Control it. Control it. It doesn't feel good to slap your face. You know that. Nice no, it doesn't. Slap. It doesn't well, feel good to slap your face. It's sticky. It hurts. It's but it's an urge. It's an urge that Patrice, is almost come on in here. irresistible. Patrice O'Neill. It just feels right. It just feels... Oh, oh, shit. Look out. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I think he got Patrice on his hat. I think he got on Patrice's hat. <laughs> <laughs> get, get the bill, get that side oh of his face God. on video. The, the whole right it's side of his face is brown. <laughs> you know how important Patrice's shit is to him? It got right on his yellow hat. <laughs> the whole side of his face is brown. clothes away now, man. Uh, it looks you, like don't, you don't damn well he's going to throw all those clothes away now. Oh, he's, he's got to. He a big piece of pudding right in the middle of his <laughs> stupid hat. And it's a yellow A's Holy hat. Shit. Like, the bill is yellow. The pudding's all the way over here. Yeah, the pudding went everywhere. I got a piece of my eye. A you piece of pudding. fucking pudding come apart like that? <laughs> <laughs> that's the way That's right. the way Bill Cosby laughs at you, man. <laughs> all right, well, that's... All right. Well, that was... Wow. That was, that was riveting. No. Oh, oh. All right. Stop slapping yourself. Hey, oh, stop. stop. It couldn't feel right. Stop. <laughs> wow. <laughs> All right, stop, stop. Oh, calm down. You want to relax? Duct, duct tape, <laughs> duct tape his hands or something. He looks like one of those oh. Japanese videos. <laughs> All he needs is a girl in a wedding dress. <laughs> I was thinking German porn. German. Oh, oh. yeah, yeah. Scheiße. Oh, All right, don't duct tape his hands. No, I don't, because it's, it's I got an egg for crying out loud or an something. Egg? Like How do you keep an egg in my hand? I don't know. That's exactly it. Dude, he's got suicide bomb. Patrice, Patrice O'Neill, everyone. Uh, hey, uh, let's go down to the park and watch the fucking uh, the what are you doing? preach and shit, and then boom. What did you do, Patrice? You are losing weight? <laughs> Yeah. I noticed that too as soon as he came he in. Lost he didn't look as fat. Looks like you, you lost a lot of weight. You didn't look as fat. I noticed it when it flew right on the middle of your hat. Someone give Patrice a wireless. You don't want to be near that microphone, no, no, Patrice. No. No, We're trying to cure him of his Tourette's today. We found out that he has a oh, new kick. He has to slap his face. <laughs> Yeah, I got back from a Tourette syndrome convention at the TSA conference, <laughs> and being around so many people just really triggered it. <laughs> what time tomorrow night, Jimmy? Uh, tomorrow, the big here's the big show. It's the short bus tour, eight o'clock uh, at the Laugh Factory. Nine o'clock. Nine o'clock. Oh, you're not, well, eight o'clock. Oh, get tickets. It's gonna be sold out. Yeah, the whole you. gang is coming. They're all gonna watch Twitch. Oh no! Slap. They're all gonna watch. Oh no! Uh, they're all gonna. It, you won't get any. You know what? It's clear fine. the monitor. Oh, oh, clear everything over there. Uh, oh my God. You can control this. Oh, my brand new. You can open control age. this. That's I right. predict <laughs> yellow. This will look just like this a Bruder film. <laughs> <laughs> and, and his left hand is a, a bunch of yeah. ketchup. Get yeah. plastic and throw it over that monitor as quickly yeah, as you, you can. Don't need plastic. Fury, come on, the run. Get What's plastic. No, it's okay. He's okay. He's not going to do Just for the it. equipment. Just slap it. Just jump. Just jump. Oh, God, All it's you want to do out of his hands. Jump. You just want to jump. Tomorrow night, big show, 9 o'clock. It's going to be the short bus tour. We're all going to be there. Colin's coming down. Right at the Laugh Factory. Laugh Factory. <laughs> big plug. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Oh. It's, uh, oh, God. Oh, my God. It's all over the place. It's going to be a big show. <laughs> uh, you know. <laughs> oh, it got all over Steve. It's the Opie and Anthony God. sign. It's all over me, man. It's everywhere. It's on the Dude. Stemmons Freeway sign. <laughs> Make them do the curling run on the floor. Paper towels. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga, oh, shit. this fucking asshole. You, Jackie O's, you. Jackie O's <laughs> crawling on the back of his chair looking for his hat. <laughs> fucking up people's clothes. It's in my hair. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, that got everywhere, man. Well, Obi, your therapy's progressing. Yeah, you're making progress. All right, progress. well, I think about, hey, 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 you got to dump, dump some of those in his hand now. Wait, wait, what? Now. Wait, wait, hold on, hold okay, on. Wait, what wait, are wait, they? Let me see. Let me They're see. Danny's pubes. Let me see. No, 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 I can't it makes me it. sick, man. What the fuck is this? I, I can't, can't do it. You're like, no, it's won't. No, no, no. We're going to cure you. We're going to cure you. This, of this is a cure. Yeah, this is a cure. Don't worry about it. Uh, how about a little vinyl icing first? 
See, because everyone... Yeah, vanilla uh, icing. It good. smells good. Oh, it certainly does. Ew. Vanilla icing. <laughs> God, would I love a giant spoonful. Oh, God damn. <laughs> what? He almost had to put his eye out with the spoon. <laughs> All right, listen, listen. Hawk was trying to spoon some out into his hand, and he went to smack himself and hit the whole thing. Yeah, just fucking just scoop his hands in there, you fucking girls. What's the matter with you guys, dainty? Yeah, you tell him. Come on, Miss Manners. Put it in his fucking hand. Yeah, come Who on. Who wouldn't want to just... Yeah, grab a handful of that if yeah, you can. Yeah, you're okay, Twitchell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. All right. There it is. There you go. There's We're not going to do it. Tomorrow guys... night, 9 o'clock, get some tickets to the short bus tour. Twitchell's actually a very good comic. <laughs> hey. We're all going to be there. It gets him excited hey, to shit. think about his big night tomorrow. Hey, if we have plastic, <laughs> uh, we really need to start getting plastic in the studio. Cause, yeah, exactly. Yeah, there's, there's chocolate good and timing. ketchup all over the board. Good timing. You're not going to slap yourself. You're going to be There's fine. No, yeah, you don't need to slap yourself anymore. You don't need to slap yourself anymore, see? It should kind of help. You don't need a slap. That's great. It won't look like a Bukaki video after nah, this one. you don't need a slap. <laughs> Wow. Yeah, you relax. Just sit. Relax. Don't, you can look, you don't need there. to do this. I don't need to do it. You don't it. need okay. to do this. Look, you just don't need relax. to do this. Just relax. Just Take relax. a deep breath. Okay. This doesn't feel good at all. No. It doesn't feel good. You're jumping see? all over the place. You just gotta yeah, just relax. Calm John. down. I just, gotta, I just gotta think of a, a nice place. Yeah, just nice really place. Calm. Exactly. I, I just gotta. I'll be fine. <laughs> I can do this. No, really, I can do this. He's playing both parts of what love got to do with it. <laughs> <laughs> all right. See, you're doing good. You don't need to slap your face. See, it's done. You're now done. Pretend you just heard River Deep so Mountain. Oh, oh God. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we Why I ought to... It's a Hey, Holy shit. It's like a gangbang video. This is awful. He's all the three stooges. got balls cut. Why are you? Yeah, he smacks himself. <laughs> Wise guy. <laughs> Come on, porcupine. He's Curly and Shemp and, and Curly Joe. Oh, my God. All right, well... Oh. There's white all over his face. We need oh. some type of cleaner on that um, oh sign my. now. You look like Fez after New Year's Windex Eve. Windex or something. <laughs> 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 That's going to be a big show. <laughs> so How do you guys feel about this? You feel good? Well, uh, there's, there's a lot I, of think, happy now. I think it's helping. Yeah, there's a lot of it crap is helping. in my I, hair I right now. I feel healing. But... Please dump that cup into his hand. Please put that <laughs> yes, cup. Yes, yes. No, oh, God, no. you yeah. can't do it. You won't. You'll be no. fine. Hey, man, we got to cure you Daddy, of the Tourette's. I'm this will cure, cure you. I can't do it. I right, can't look, do the I know. Pill. The studio is being... I know that you won't. No amount of money can make that happen. Put the You will control yourself. I can't do it. You will. You will control yourself. I won't. Do you think no. I should do it? Do you yes, honestly think yes, I should? Yes. <laughs> you will control I yourself. I don't think you'll slap yourself with it is why why you're, I think you should do it. The best part of this... I think that's the thing I mean, that'll keep you from I think this is yourself. the first time Danny's ever, like, uh, trimmed up. Because no, it's that's like that's a that's fucking that's forest that's in that. Here's what it is. Oh, God. It. You know how when you chew your nails, <laughs> it's they... It's the bottom possible part of the thigh. <laughs> keep going, keep going. They put a glove on you. They put they put something on your nails to stop you from chewing. Right. Yeah, yeah. Psychos. We have nail biting. Problems. Right. So this is kind of the same thing. The other stuff is all food. Stuff in his hand. Yeah, but Tourette's is completely right. uncontrollable. No, I, never I, I know that, no, but there's times when you're acting You'll where you don't never, feel it. Uh, yeah, you're acting, and it's but obvious, this will so. be such an overwhelming thing oh. that it'll... That's what it'll, I'm talking about, nigga. Wow. <laughs> it'll counteract... It'll That's counteract the... That's how my in my face. <laughs> You know what? I'll do it. I'll do it. Yeah. It'll counteract think, it. Wow. I'll try. Hold on. I'll try. Wait, you, Hold don't, on. you don't honestly think you had a choice, did you? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right? I Lewis, just, he's going to dump a little bit better knowing. I Sweet thought. Lewis, he's going to dump some into each hand. He's stopping ten of you. He doesn't have a knife. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking. Oh, all right. No, just go ahead. get him in there. Spoon sprinkle out. sprinkle liberally in oh, each hand. Yeah. All right. Yes. Pubes are going into. Oh, God oh, damn it. Make sure they stick to the stuff there. Reach over and do the other hand, too, Danny. What are you, a queer? Oh, my God. Now press him on there. Press him on there. You got to Leave him in there, Twitchell. You got yeah, yeah. No, there was some hanging around. Oh, that's there good. it is. There's no oh way. God. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, God. Danny's, Danny's cute. Danny's cute. Holy crap. Danny's I don't think I'm going to lick the icing oh, anymore. Oh, my God. <laughs> Danny's cube. Oh, now you can just relax. That is now you lot. control yourself, right? Wait. Watch us cure Tourette's. They, we have a treatment here at the clinic, the Opie and Anthony Institute. That's right. <laughs> we'll uh, show you how to cure Tourette's. And John, 
We got the dick face treatment. <laughs> <laughs> Anthony, we got to explain, though. I mean, that is a lot of pubes. Because uh, people at home are thinking, eh, maybe one or two. No, no, no. no. It is. Danny, yeah. look Danny look looks like he'd look be a this. hairy like, guy. It, it looks like huge And clumps. if you've ever seen Danny's nuts and dick oh, on God. Pal Talk, you looks, know there's a lot of hair down there. It looks like he's holding good times <laughs> and coolie high. <laughs> Just ask, call up oh, Danny's God. mom and ask him how many pubes right. Danny but, has, yeah, and he'll yeah, tell you. Yeah, See, you're yeah. doing good, man. You're doing, you're doing good. good. You're tough. By the Your way, hand wants oh, to slap. God. You want to slap. You do, but you just going to be okay. See, you can't Relax. slap the pubes on your face. Danny didn't even shower today. Yeah, they're no. sweaty. Don't die. Uh, he doesn't uh, shower see, before. Oh, you're scratching your nose at Danny's pubes. I see. That finger is... Don't slap. Don't slap. The icing is... Get um, lodged in my nostril. Can someone help yeah. me blow my nose? No, you're okay. Oh, you're it's about. okay. Don't slap. Jump. Ah, you don't need a slap. You don't need a slap. The Tourette's thing is all in your mind. Uh, dude. Big show tomorrow this night. It's, it's, yep. it's at 9 o'clock at the Laugh Factory. Mind. Laugh Factory, the Short Bus Comedy Tour. Myself, Jimmy Graham, Mike Attaio, Tim Grill. We all have disability. <laughs> what's, the, uh, what's the phone number? Uh, oh, God. It's go to laughfactory.com. Oh, no, we don't have the it? number offhand. It's the Laugh Factory right in Times Square. Was it on 42nd? 42nd Street. You work it. It's one of the It's one of the biggest clubs now. It's going well for you. We're all coming down to I'm, see you. After doing this, I'm dead serious. I want you guys there. Yeah, we will Absolutely. all be there. Absolutely. Nah, we are none curing. Of us. Oh, hey, you're okay. We are curing oh, Tourette. We're all Thanks. coming to see you Thanks. tomorrow. Look how close you came, but you were able to control it. He almost broke his wrist. He's trying to keep that fucking puke. He was in his neck. He was thinking about like a Chinese contortionist. He slapped you. He goes stupid. Slap the. He stopped his hand in in midair, and everything else went forward. He wants to. You know what? I bet the icing is really fucking. Can, up can you let me try to do something to calm this? Can oh. I read something? Reading while we take a look at the hills jump. You hey, you gotta give me some leeway. Jump. I'm willing to do this. Jump, 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 jump. Slap, 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 it's so nice to slap your oh, face. God. There's no way you're going to slap your so face. Nice. Now nah, you don't want to slap your you're face. You're almost cured, see? You're, you're not going to slap your face. It's it's not going to slap. You know that it's, it's going to make everything okay, but you don't need to do it. That's right. There's it feels, other ways. It's like, I know the immediate thing. I just have an thing. image of my, fa in my head slapping my face right now. I'm really, oh. really this is really oh, hard. Man. You know it would feel good. I can't good. cry because the icing's in the way. You know it would feel good, but you don't need to do it. Yeah, you're no. not going to do it. You don't need to slap your face. I'm doing it now, and it doesn't feel good. Oh, my God. Damn it! Oh God! Oh, he's spitting out Danny's pubes. He's spitting out Danny's pubes. Oh, oh my God, no! Let me hear Oh, he's spitting Danny's pubes out. Oh my God, is this funny slash really sad? Can you get some? Can you help me with my eye? I got. Wipe his eye. He's got Danny's pubes in his eye. Could wipe his eye. Somebody help him. Exactly. Not Eric, how do you usually get them out of yours? <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Oh! Oh, he smack talks on! That's right. Fuck, God damn it! Oh, Oh, he's got Danny's goose all over his arm. Holy shit. That's right. <laughs> Wipe it oh off. My I, I can't see now at all. all. I, can't, I can't see now at all. I need someone to help me get the stuff Wipe out. his eyes. Hey, fucking help him out over there. Come oh, on. Oh, oh, my God. You're okay. You're, you're, you're going to be okay. Danny's oh, puke from his elbow. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh, he didn't see that coming. I, I, it's burning my left eye. <laughs> oh, my God. Holy crap, that's no, the funniest thing oh, ever. Holy shit. Ever. Oh, you can still exactly. got some on your yeah, elbow don't there. Don't slap oh. again. Don't slap again because you get a whole bunch of pubes in that I hope we're hand. describing that. He again. had a handful of pubes. A handful of pubes that went right onto Hawk's arm. He went to slap his face, and Eric put his arm in the way, the and he sent of the eye. It's pubes like, and white uh, uh, sticky stuff all over, all over his arm. The underside of his arm. Old faggot yeah. arms. Oh, nah. oh, that side hasn't been slapped. That side's doing okay. The right one you did it, but that oh, left yeah. one you didn't do it. Yeah, the left side still has a whole handful of Danny's pubes in it. Oh, you know that boy. weird feeling when your face just rocks with that thing? Like, yeah. It's really weird. Like, you know, yeah. oh my God, that feels good. Wow, you oh. don't want to do that, though. Cause I, I, no, you don't want to do that. And you're trying to cure the Tourette's. Yeah. Absolutely. Okay, this, Absolutely. Is all, this is all for my benefit. Yes. 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 Okay, all right, I believe you. We're <laughs> doing the work of God. Big Laugh Factory show. <laughs> yeah, Laugh Factory. Switching tape. Well, then switch it. Go ahead. Yeah, hurry up. Tomorrow night, 9 o'clock, 
at the Laugh Factory in Times Square. Would you actually have seen you in a while? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Lucky yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lucky yeah, you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I like to make small talk with another man's pubes yeah, stuck to your face with icing. Good yeah. to see you. <laughs> How's your dignity? <laughs> okay. I haven't wow. seen that in a while. You're not gonna have, are you, hey, what else? Can, what else? Going to have me walk, walk around? Hold on, we got pubes in his left right? hand, oh, still in his left hand. What? Do what? That. No, don't do, don't do that. What can we put in his right hand? Um, peanut butter. Peanut look at butter. this. Look at this. There's a video of Ross on last Opie. comic stand. Anthony. Yeah. Guys, there's little clumps of the icing, and there's a, a pubic hair like popping through one of the clumps, yeah. sticking up. And Dude. and this one still is full, and this is just like it's starting to get wedged underneath one of my fingernails. Oh, one of the pu. You're gonna slap. And it's like really. It has to happen. Oh god. Yeah. Here, hold, ah. hold this egg. <laughs> Tape it. Just hold, hold this egg. No, don't give me the egg. You'll hit his face with the egg. No egg. No. No, I don't want the egg. Hold no. the egg. All right, I'll take the egg. Just hold the egg. Just hold it. If you drop it, we throw the entire eggs at you. Oh my what? God. What? No, he could just, just that'll relax you. Yeah, relax. Right? So. See, relax, relax. Look, the egg is just balanced in your right hand. The pubes right. are in your left. Danny's pubes in your left hand. A whole pile of you them. You guys are humanitarians. What you're doing is the great. The pubes Thank will you. not end up on your face. We know that. Okay, well, you got right, some on the right side of your face. We understand that. I but. see no oh, see, oh. see, you were able to control it. You, see? What, were you an inch away from slapping your face? And you stopped. Right? And you, you just stopped. stopped. Yeah. See? Oh. <laughs> you don't want to slap with that left hand. Anyone want pubic hair eggs? Look at all oh. the pubes on his cheek. And he just slapped uh, with the egg in his hand. It didn't really yeah. uh, do you know much what? damage. No, but no, very hard to break an egg. Stop. Oh, oh no, no, yeah. no more slaps with the left hand. Keep Look, left he's hand. using his right hand too much. He knows. No, right, you got to get something I'm in his right hand. Maybe. Right hand. I don't want the left hand hit me. Left. <laughs> throw some, yeah, throw another egg in his hand. Exactly. No, no, no. No more, no more slaps. That one kind of cracked. See, what's going on here, he does want to use his left hand because he doesn't want the pubes on his face. Oh. So he's using his right hand to slap he's his face. He's got pubes stuck to his face. The right side. The left side. Yeah, but not perfect. as much because that, that left hand has a pile of pubes. Perfect. I don't look too bad, right? No, it's unfocused. It needs to be balanced. All right, thank you. Looks like a slap happy video. Yeah. Okay. Just running down your face, the right. icing Look, and just honey. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Look at the back of his head. Oh, Look at the shit. back of his head. Exactly. Oh, turn around, turn around. Oh, you got nails. <laughs> Egg right in the back. Wait, what's your name? Sean. Sean. Egg right in the back of Sean's head. He missed his face. The egg went flying across the room <laughs> into the wall. Sean in the back of the head. Which is now washing. The, that, the egg is washing yeah. the chocolate off the wall. Right. All right. Oh, well, God. maybe we shouldn't uh, use the eggs anymore. There goes Sean leaving the studio uh, as a direct hit yeah, to his stupid. head. Boy, is he taking out a lot of people. Eggs to the head, pubes to the arm. <laughs> Fucking pudding oh. to the hat. Pudding right. to the hat. I, I whenever I try to control it, I usually <laughs> bite my lower lip, and I just took a mouthful of pubes. Nah. Right here. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. That's, I'm dead serious. That would be bad. See, Thank this God is God worse all candy. around. It's like interacting with my focus now. Yeah. All right. Focus. Uh. Focus. 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 Okay. You looking right. forward to the show tomorrow night? Let's I'm really looking. Forward. <laughs> looking forward hey, to it. Hey, do we have more chocolate pudding left? Are I'll, you looking forward to yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah, I can't wait because we got a whole bunch of people coming down. Awesome. Colin said he's coming. Patrice, myself, Phil Burr. It's gonna be a lot. Of Bob Kelly. It's gonna be all the guys from the show. Uh, <laughs> we got Lauren Michaels. He's gonna stop by. Oh come on! Just stop it. Yeah, he's a friend of ours. Yeah. Don't get too excited about that though. <laughs> he sees a lot of comedians. So I mean, not, so far, no, don't put it in the left not hand. Not that yet, big of a deal. <laughs> Two inside what? Uh, <laughs> don't do lefty. Don't the left hand, man. I know you want to hit. It would. You know the right hand's not getting the job done. By the way. You know the right hand slapping your face is not getting the job done. Obviously, it is because I'm managing the control of the left hand. Yeah, exactly. That's why yeah, we know it's all in your head. It's working. This is our cure. Your left hand does not need to slap. Only your right. So your left hand's fine. You're not going to use it. Yeah, don't, don't slap with your left hand. The right hand has another pile of chocolate pudding in it. Unfortunately, that might end up on your face, but the left hand's still oh. holding strong with the pubic oh, hair in it. Have you ever done both together? Like the, oh, the whole yeah. Thing. yeah, the two. The two oh, hands. Yeah. It probably two. feel great. Great. Oh, the two hands. No, you don't want to oh, do no, it. No, don't. You, you're, you're controlling it. Twitchells, you're so, you're so close to being cured. We can see it. Yeah. We can see it. Don't give in to the beast. Yeah, this is starting in. to become noticeable, by the way. You just like both hands together. Yeah, if we both, if I'm everyone goes like this in the studio, look. Sweat, so what? Just look, putting, I can hurt you. Like it matters. Look, if we all do this, if we all do this, see, nothing happens. No, no, don't all do it. No. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. Uh, uh, just think uh, about that. Slap. Slap, slap in the face, uh, both sides. Slap. slap. Both together feels right. Actually. Yeah, it feels oh, really feels, good, Jimmy. That does feel right. It's something about There's something it. wrong it's about very, just one. It's but very when you do both, it feels perfect. It's very. Very calming. It's perfect.
Oh, that's right with the world good. when you do this. It's uh, perfect. Wow, this does work. Oh, my this God. This feels good. I feel like yeah, I'm uh, in a so womb or something. You think he's slick. Yeah. yeah. I think you hit that other kid by, on purpose with that egg. <laughs> <laughs> I think you came in too late to, to see what's been going on here. Ooh. Excuse me, Captain Correct. Excuse me. I got Don't pubic get fucking hairs on my oh, face. Oh, shut up, bitch. Oh, oh, stop being a bitch and slap yourself with the pubes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we can move on to the comedy with Patrice O'Neill. <laughs> 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 I think we give a shit. Yeah. Yeah. So, we could, so we could clean up the front row at the Gallagher show. Oh, there's more pubes in his mouth. Oh, shit. There's the showstopper. Oh, Slap his face really oh, hard. Pubes all over Chocolate his face. Chocolate pudding to the right of his oh, face. His... And, and Danny's pubes on the left hand oh, oh, side God. of his face. Toretto Manic. <laughs> <laughs> he, he now looks like an old man that can't get the shave done. <laughs> There's always something left over Some after he shaves. Right. This, is, this is bordering on exploiting this illness. Oh, man. <laughs> oh my wow. God. Well, well, I gotta say, uh, I don't think our cure works, Opie. Yeah. Well, we try though. You know. Yeah, I, we try. It's, it's trial and error. Phase one testing. Opie's gonna bring the stock down because it didn't really work very well. Yeah, we're, yeah, we're really banking face. on yeah. phase two. You know. You, you, you really truly describe this as a scientific. Yeah, I, I came in late, but this is you could prove this to be scientific. It is scientific. Just look at him. Yeah. <laughs> Next week we're gonna try to cure alcoholism. <laughs> okay. Field research. Tourette's is not cured by putting shit in the hand. Yeah. Now someone can <laughs> take note of that and now not waste their time doing this. That's, That's right. right. Not, it's, it, 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 go it, it, on to the next thing. Right. Try something else. I'm dead serious. This is a fucking scientific proven. This, this is damn scientific. Can I clean myself up now? Yeah, wait, yeah. wait a minute. Pubic hair. Might have a fifty percent effect. <laughs> right, the one not, hand. He wouldn't slap himself with the pubic. Right. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure they're gonna start subscribing. Further research Subscribe. must be done. All right, why don't we get him outside in the streets of Manhattan, in front of the building? Um, Give it. To announce it didn't work. <laughs> All right, make sure he doesn't clean up. Let's get him outside. Maybe Danny or someone could call on the phone. That's right. All right, uh, Twitchells, why don't you... Uh... Just try to be incognito on the elevator. Yeah. How do I get out of here? Just walk. We'll, like, we'll open all yeah, the doors for you. This is just, all over my face. Oh, where, where's Just the comedy show tomorrow? In. Uh, tomorrow night at the at the Laugh Factory in Times Square, nine o'clock is the Short Bus Comedy Tour. I, I'm dead serious. You'll mean a lot to me if you guys are there. <laughs> I uh, I, I want to get your hopes up. All right, <laughs> you bastard. Uh, all right, so I walk out now. At the yeah, corner, yeah, right. showing up. It's at the corner, <laughs> and in between. <laughs> Fucking, fucking idiot. Between help and me. <laughs> fucking complete idiot. Oh, my God. Look, is that a big clump of pube and icing on the uh, arm of the chair? That chair has right to be thrown out. The best part. I came here all dressed cute for you guys. I, I know. In a while. You're on your A's shit. I have shit. brand new A's shit. My green stripe on my fucking the Nikes. The second match. he opened the door, you got wow. ambushed. I'm like, a, like a suicide bomb. Like I a know how fucking, it goes down. Like a Chinese food delivery man in the Bronx. <laughs> <laughs> Open the door, boom, right in the face. It wouldn't be bad if this was like a Cleveland Browns hat with a color, but this is right. Fucking nice yellow and yellow. Patrice, I walk in, man. will you ever wear that hat again? It's, I gotta buy another one. Oh, yeah, yeah you gotta buy obvious. another one. That it's sucks. Over. I'm sorry. I'm it's, sorry. That we hat is done. done. Over for the hat. Made for some great radio. How bad would that look to walk around with a big stain on the fucking hat? Yeah, we can't do It doesn't that. work. Hey, are we calling? Yeah, we will be. All right, Jesus. should we take a quick break? Uh, you can if you want. Uh, yeah, we should uh, take a break. When we get back, we'll have Twitchell's live on the streets of Manhattan. Uh, looking, looking like a complete lunatic. Looking like a mess. Looking like? Chocolate pudding all over his face and ketchup crazy. still remaining on his Pubic face. Hair is Pubic genius. hair is on uh, all over his face. <laughs> all over his shirt that he's wearing. Uh, and with the twitching, uh, we're going to get some good looks from uh, these dopes Do you know there. chocolate made it all the way almost to my keyboard? Hit me in the eye. Did it? It's right Dude. there. Oh, there's some here. It's in my hair. Oh, Jesus Christ. It's on the phone screen. There's a pube right here, too. You got hair and thing. There's no pube over here. All right, I we'll know the velocity potential of the pubic hair, and it could not have made it over here. <laughs> the velocity. Hawk got it all over his arm. That exactly. was probably Danny the pubes. funniest part. Danny pubes all over his arm. He went to wipe off Twitchell's face, and the second he put his arm over there, Twitchell freaked out, smacked him, and just got pubic hair and icing all over Hawk's arm. Let's say hi to Ken in Missouri. Ken? Hey, what's up? Hey, Ken. 
Hey, yeah, uh, you guys keep saying this is the cure. I wasn't aware that dignity was a disease. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. You guys are killing me. I'm punching out. I, I, I think a lot of people might have turned off their XM radios today. Ah, could be. Could be. I don't know how that works. It's better than doing it to a mouse. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <Where the mouse? laughs> All right, why don't we uh why don't we take a break? Patrice O'Neill in studio. Who's Kenny Loggins over there? Where? Oh that's uh um, <laughs> that's intern Bill. <laughs> what happened to Kenny Loggins? <laughs> Fuck that, <man. laughs> we never pulled that one out. <laughs> that is fucking Jesus funny, man. Christ. Kenny a Loggins. <laughs> a foot loose. A foot loose. <laughs> <laughs> it looks fucking ridiculous. I'm all right. <laughs> Come in with a full fucking beer. <laughs> he grew that over the weekend, so oh, he's one of those awful. guys. He's one of those guys. Oh, God. All right, why don't we... Why don't this we... is it. <laughs> Make no mistakes where you are. Who the fuck is that? That's, <laughs> That's Mike McDonald That's and Kenny Loggins. <laughs> it's a duet. <laughs> <laughs> if that was all white, he could be uh, Mike McDonald. <laughs> oh, oh, Danny's already outside. Let's uh, let's go to Danny. Danny. Hey guys, what's up? Hey buddy. Hey, man. Say again? Yeah, what's up? Uh, well, we're on the street here in front of the building uh, with Twishels. He's still covered in shit. Right. And uh, we did not let him wash uh, anything off of him, so he's still got pubes all over himself, pudding. Icing, everything, he's a mess. Is he getting some good looks out there? Well, yeah, I mean, <laughs> he's uh, he's kicking uh, very badly and obviously covered in shit. How could you not stare at him? <laughs> <laughs> Got to get some of the uh, the, the stares. I'll try and hold the phone towards him so you can hear uh, you can hear him kicking. What? What, what am I doing? Well, what am I oh doing? doing? <laughs> You can see how much look people are giving us idiots. Are you right outside our door? Outside the um, almost. If you'd like, we can move so that you could see us. If you'd like, we can move across the street so you could easily see out the window. Yeah, out across the street so we can watch you out the window. Yeah, move across the street. Someone take the... I'll hang here. Just take the wireless or something. Okay, oh, wait. We can uh, see through there, right? across yeah. the street. So yeah. with me. All right. We're going we're gonna to cross the street so you can see out the window. All right, hang in. Traffic. Yeah. <sighs> Holy crap. Oh, what happened? Oh. Well, we lost him. He probably flung the phone into the street. <laughs> oh, that was God really, damn. really, really funny, man. Now clean up this mess, <laughs> you guinea bread. Go on and twitch, just like your father. <laughs> 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 I love the cleanup portion of this. Oh, Danny's back. The studio smells so nice. Danny. Hey, sorry, guys. The phone cut out. All right. All right, we're across the street, so you should be able to see us uh, right now. Can you see anything yet? Uh, I can never see out of this. Yeah, I, see I see Danny. He's oh, off to the yeah, left there. Yeah. yeah. Are they Same. avoiding twitchels, or, or is he getting any looks? Or? It's New York. No one even notices him. No, we got a, a nice young lady right here who's absolutely uh, entranced by the situation. She sounds it. <laughs> oh, you're hanging out with me? Yeah, well, uh, 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 yeah, talking. No, uh, uh, I can't hear them. Because he won't let me. He won't let me hold the phone. Yeah, well, I mean, he's got he's got icing and shit all over his face. I'm not giving him my and, phone. And your pubes. We should just have Twitch and start yelling, "Help me! Help me! Ear. Help me!" <laughs> <laughs> Mitchells, Danny, Danny, Danny. I can barely hear you. Twitchells, we want you to start yelling, help me, help me. Start yelling, help me? Yeah. <laughs> That's not a check. Just, you mean you just, just want me to do it? Yeah, if you want to plug for your comedy show tomorrow, I would suggest you start yelling, help me, help me, help me. <laughs> like, uh, like where? Like just right where I'm standing now? Yeah. yeah give kind the of walk around to, in circles. Give the phone back to Danny and start yelling, help me, help me, help me. He said, give the, no, 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 no. give the phone back to you and start yelling, help me. Okay, so that's what you guys want? Yeah. Okay, hang on. Where is he at? Right there. Right there? Okay. Help me! <laughs> oh, my God. 
People are running away. They're running away. She won't help me. She won't help me. <laughs> Help me. Help me. Help me. Yeah. I, I've never seen right? New Yorkers alarmed or shocked by anything. Right? Yeah. They're, they're they're like giving them a wide berth and running. <laughs> he went, Danny went to make him say something on the phone and he went to slap his face. He knocked stupid Danny's phone on the concrete. Oh man, that was Good. the last thing we ever heard from Danny's phone. It was a loud beeping noise. <laughs> <laughs> and he's laughing hysterical, Danny, as his phone is broken. That's right. All right. Enough with that nonsense. I know. Enough is enough. Enough with that Tourette's. Jesus. Exactly. <sighs> now let's just start announcing that the show is canceled. And no one knows. <laughs> <laughs> Tourette's is the disease. We're the cure. God, Regis decided to dye his hair a little darker than usual. Oh, yeah? Oh, my God. That, that looks normal on a 76-year-old man. Yes. yes. He's got the Ronald Reagan hair. <laughs> okay, we're going to take a break. All right. Oh, wait, he's back? No, can't be. That phone is busted. Look at Ben's hairdo. Danny. <laughs> Where? Danny. It's awful. Hey, suck him on. <laughs> hey, Florence Henderson. <laughs> you should be on a lesbian cruise with that hair. God. <laughs> Fucking, that bob cut is atrocious. Nice do. <laughs> hey, ben. He just nods at you. <laughs> you can almost hear him just calling you an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Are those a Lysol sanitary wipes? Mm -hmm. Ben, are Thank we going to be all right? Yeah. All right. We're just trying to clean up the studio. Danny. You. Hey, Danny. What's going on, guys? What's up? Uh, like I said, uh, Eric's phone took uh, some damage, but I'm on uh, another phone. Oh, that was Eric's phone? <laughs> oh, that's why you were laughing so hard. <laughs> I was wondering why he was laughing at his own broken phone. What happened when he started yelling, help me, help me? <laughs> I mean, he was... People are absolutely just, they just want them to run away, actually, like, going straight up to, uh, to you know, people trying to get to work and just screaming, help me in their faces. <laughs> they were running, yeah. Do we have video of this? Oh, absolutely. All right. Are we done? Yes, we're done. With All right, Danny, thank you. The day. Welcome, fellas. All just, right. The last thing, push him under a bus. <laughs> do that. I say we don't let Twitchell's back into the studio because he's embarrassing himself. <laughs> Please cut that shit out. Yeah, you know, have some pride. Man. All right, we're going to take a break. Alan Light is here, by the way, too. Huh? Alan Light. Right there. there you go. What was the last thing he had to come in the middle of, too? He showed up at some other weird oh, thing. Oh, we'll ask him, yeah. Cause the, 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 the what? The NCAA. Oh, crap. And that was the last time we did anything crazy in here. That's the only reason Alan Light came back, because we didn't get into anything, because silly stuff was going on around him. All right, we'll talk some music with Alan Light. we got Patrice O'Neill in the studio. And uh, other things to get to. The boobs always bring the curse. I'm trying to push buttons so we can talk on the radio, but there's like... Are they goopy? Uh, there's pudding on CD number two. There's frosting on Ant's mic. Hawk, get that. Yeah. I cleaned up over here, and then I... Purell. <laughs> I love you really got... Give me some Purell. You really got a uh, fucking go. uh, Eric working like a goddamn slave. Hey, man. Uh, yeah. Clean that off, Kunta. Like? <laughs> like. He is, he is the slave of the program. See, we do this every once in a while because we know these guys are sitting around going, uh, you know, they're coasting. Oh, no. Yeah. We're going to make you work eventually. One of those days. Oh, good. They uh, used some kind of cleaner on the yep. grand Opie and Anthony oh, sign. Oh, thank God the Opie and Anthony sign is all clean. Took a hit with some uh, ketchup. Yeah, hey, I went by the, uh, by the way, the uh, Javits Center. XM has a nice presence at the Javits Center, man. You're right over the big entrance. You got like a picture of Snoop, a picture of Cal Ripken, a picture of somebody else. Oh, nice. Yeah. Everybody, uh... That's good. Involved in on the platform. Absolutely. Except maybe. Except maybe guys that do a show every day. That's nah, all right. <laughs> oh, yeah, hockey. <laughs> and uh, they do a show for more than a half hour. Jeter and Snoop and <laughs> hockey. Right. Hey, did you hit a, a homer last night? No. Exactly. No? No? no. I couldn't even get jerked off for money. Yeah, of course. Hey, we have to say hi to Alan Light. Hi, Alan. Hello, you guys. Sorry to make hey. you wait. Hey man, I, last time I was in here it was is a guy tweezing his pubic hairs. Oh, that's this right. time I'm in here and oh. I don't know what it, you know. Dude, I gotta say it's not usually pubes. We, uh, see, my number's uh, coming up wrong here. I don't not know. Not just why. pubes. We usually stay hair. away from the pubic hair. It's usually the whole package: dick, balls, and <laughs> <Yeah>. pubes. <laughs> we like it, men. Yeah, a bunch of men with a mouthful, <laughs> draining each other out. And I was asking Patrice O'Neill because he has all his brand new A's. <laughs> stuff, even though he doesn't like the A's. It just looks it good on him. Good. 
I don't. I I really want to understand. I <laughs> I watch Web Junk Twenty and Every once he in a while. comes on looking like a Pokemon. There's <laughs> just so many colors and things, and it's like a uniform. You can name one A. Not, name, not name. even. <laughs> it could be the Oakland Z's, motherfucker. <laughs> Green and yellow. Doesn't matter, right? Doesn't Every once in, good. Every once in a while, I'll buy a Mets cap or an Islanders cap. I hate wearing the Mets cap because they just haven't figured that out yet. They look ridiculous still. Well, Mets caps, I got to say, I know a lot of Mets fans here in New York, but uh, <sighs> Mets caps are great for girls and old men. Awful NW, that curly. It's yeah, they, terrible, it, terrible uh, 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 fr merchandising. You're just corn balls. No, I, yeah. corn balls. Yeah. no, I know it's terrible because you don't see the brothers wearing the Mets uh, gear yeah, at all. Never. It's good colors. What is it? You like, will it's like never. blue or red. Yeah, or there's some orange no, in there. It's, it's, it's good colors. Blue, but orange. Color blue is yeah. blue is usually a very safe color. They pick the only type of blue that's not safe. <laughs> you, you are I mean? so. I never noticed. Blush you blue. never see a brother wearing <laughs> Mets stuff because it doesn't look good. No, not even. In the field. <laughs> they, yeah, the brothers are like, ah, oh, man, Trey, the Mets. Gotta wear this shit. Yeah. Uh, it's it's fucking up my game, yeah. man. Yeah. Yeah. Yankees gotta be number one, man. Oh, that oh yeah. Is just Everywhere you go. It's ridiculous, man. They got the greatest hats. And the Mets are like, see. we have an NY here, too. Yeah, look, why, why isn't ours as popular? It's, it's like a curly... It's like some written in a calligraphy yeah, pen or something. Just, just, oh, just, oh hear you, hear you. <laughs> you are a New York Mets fan. So why the A's gear? I just bought a whole bunch at once. I have uh, bought a Cincinnati Reds. You buy a bunch of different teams and just, just hang it up. I'll go to a Red Sox game in a Cincinnati Reds. <laughs> what is red? What the fuck's wrong with you not got red in the name? I ain't got representing them, but I'm just saying it just doesn't look good. Dude, could, you, could you save money for more than a month? He gets fucking money, and you always know Patrice has a gig because he's got a, a new ring or a new outfit. Or a... I have uh, learned from my friend uh, Anthony Cumia. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, I'm, I'm contemplating taking off my top eight because it's really not doing me any good because you're so not. fucking selfish. I'll <laughs> put you on my top eight. I just I, I'm I'm putting a couple of people this ass nothing. I Here's took little Kev off. I'll tell you the truth of the matter with my top eight. I haven't changed it in MySpace, so long on MySpace because you can't search through 20,000 friends to find anybody. And I'm yeah. not going to sit there and go, there's one page. That takes care of 10 people. All right. Only uh, 19,900 uh, more to go. Wait well, I'm, I'm sorry. I apologize. I'm I learned from, I'm not nigga rich no more. No. So I needed these clothes. You need clothes in show business. Sure. Yeah. You know, if you're black. I look good. I'm not sure white people need clothes. No. But, you know. But just because there's a tiny spot of that's pudding gotta go. on the hat. No, nah, that's got to go. That's garbage. It's destroyed, right? No way of saving that. You that's know what? Right. That, that, right. that no. should be on a homeless guy's head by noon today. It's It's gone. Actually, sign yeah. it. We'll throw it on eBay. Is you this think, gonna, do, right. Yeah, right. Yeah, He's putting it on his top of sleep, on the top of his yeah, the jacket. Yeah, the Tourette's... The Tourette's uh, pudding hat, a ambush hat. Pudding ha and what else hat. do you have to destroy? Uh, Pretty much the whole outfit? No, because you can watch this. You're going to yeah. be all right with the, the A's top? Yeah, you can't watch the hat, though. Nah. So, so I'll that's sign it. Yeah, give it. that's cool. Right. Yeah, but I want to say your, your house made me try, try to save. Yeah, try to save a little. I, I'm jealous of your fucking crib. I got to get me a... So I got to get out of gotta this situation. Got to get something nice. I really am awful. Nice. People saw how I live. They'll be like, is this how the web junk nigga lives? You got to grow up. The O&A web junk <laughs> letterman nigga. Look at what he's doing. <laughs> oh, look at how he sticks the letterman in there. Yeah, me, and, me and DL, man, we got along. You know what I mean? Yeah. Dude, you had a, you me had a great Dave spot. Home. You had a great spot with letterman. They sat Talking me about down. the web junk. Yeah. yeah. Got great to just sit and talk. That's pretty damn cool, yeah, man. I was going to try to sneak the radio in, but he was kind of driving. Yeah. Uh, I was going to try to he sneak He steers it. it pretty good. He just steers it pretty yeah. good. I enjoy that. That's you know, good. I'm Keeps go, you on track. I'm going to go see D-Bone again in July. Oh, D-Bone. <laughs> <laughs> that is a pal. And I didn't have to do stand-up to sit down either, you know. Some, a, lot, a lot of the shows, you got to do stand-up first. Yeah. Oh, and they call you doing. over and stuff. Right. But they just, hey, come on, sit down, Patrice. Are you trying to make fun of our little pal? He no. does. What happened? Well, no, 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 he performs. I, what do you yeah, he does a little stand up. I can't, I can't let that go. I can't say that name. What's that name you said? Jay Leno. Oh. I can't say that name because um, because they they said I'm to exclusively just do Letterman when you I go on part? late night. I can't. Uh, that, I can't say the L word. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the funny part. Because I, I, do, I do the L word. <laughs> but then fucking DL's people called and said, we'd like to have you here too. You're kidding me. We said thanks, but no thanks. You, wow. Oh, look at that. Be serious. It, why? Why? Show they tell you? loyalty, my I friend. I prefer the L. I like Fair Fair enough. Enough. Do you understand they're both L? 
Letterman. And they're both L.E. Oh, they're L.E. Yeah. Jesus. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him. He's the Good point. <laughs> East Coast, West Coast. <laughs> yeah. Well, there you go. Fool ass nigga. What you doing <laughs> doing Leno, nigga? <laughs> Bust in your face, fool. He's Fuck West wrong Coast. with you. Well, there is an East Coast, West Coast comedy thing that happens, too, but it's not like the rap thing. No, no. it ain't. It's, it's, it's but, they, but you guys do hate each other. And for some reason, man, it's weird. Yeah. It's, it's hilarious, man. But it's pussy compared to the rappers, you know. Can I ask you a you question off the subject? I, I'm sorry. Alan Light. I, I, Big time question. writer. One question before you get into no. Alan Light. Yeah. Just one. Well, hold on a minute. We're not going to get into Alan Light. We're just going to hang. You think we have an actual interview planned? Oh, no? I know. Oh. Yeah, I know better than that. <laughs> your, uh, your influence is now yeah. growing up. <laughs> get it going. I, I miss this. Mm-hmm. Because I don't have one of those things to walk around with, a, um, to listen to XM all the Why time. Why doesn't he have one? No, Why no. would he? That would be good. Oh. <laughs> Why would they give What a... is going on with you guys and Dice? What is going on? Dice. I'm, honest to God, what I have happened? no idea. Dice is just a uh, uh, disloyal, self-centered Was asshole. Was this before the radio? Uh, before he did the uh, radio show on Sirius? Or... Well, he, he was friends with the show. We we helped him out a lot. Got him back into Madison Square Garden after he was like, you know, nothing. Uh, and, you know, when we were off the air, I guess we didn't really serve a purpose for him, plugging any gigs and stuff. So, uh, But Ope went out there, hung out with him. They were friends. And then uh, we get back on the air here, try to get him back on the show. One of those people we would have loved to have back on and uh, rekindle the friendship on the air. For some reason, and there have been varying reasons, he didn't come on the show and then uh, lo and behold he shows up on stern uh and his top priority on that show is just sitting there and bad mouthing us who did nothing to him but you know treat him uh with the respect uh, that he was the not course, if you know anything about dice and the people that work for him he does this to everybody he's so. a bridge burner like a madman the guy has no friends in show business because uh he he treats everyone like shit he'd rather uh blow off the relationship we made with him that goes back a few years now to sell a few extra tickets for governors on long island that's the reality of it right. yeah. when he was doing our show we were getting him into the beacon theater and madison square garden <laughs> And next thing you know, like we we did him wrong for some reason. Yeah. So he's pathetic. Did Pat Cooper ever come on? He was no, supposed to come on, now. and I don't know what the hell's going I on. I think with he that. made up with Howard, didn't he? Yeah, he's, <laughs> Jesus uh, he's on one of Howard's uh, channels, I think. All right. Curiosity. Been gone. I haven't seen. It's honestly, seen in a while. it's sad, but there's no real surprise there. I knew uh, when uh, Dice started doing our show that it would probably end like weird. Yeah. Because he's just that type of guy. Well, I can tell you. With another season of Web Junk and and me and DL hanging out, you guys still yeah. in the mornings. I'll still stop through. Thanks, man. <laughs> you ass. Just stop through. I was watching Web Junk and I see. It's hard to forget where you came from when you're still right there. Where are you still, are you still right across the street? <laughs> I could I be trying to be up an echelon and it just don't work. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you kidding? We said a show up at 9. You were here at 8.30. You couldn't wait. You couldn't wait to I'm get in here. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking pudding hat. <laughs> Coming in with my brand new... Uh... <laughs> Hello, everybody. Pudding in the face. There you go. All right, I, I, was watching, I, was, I was watching Web Junk, and I saw, like, your second... Like clip show thing that they did, like the best of the best of. How long has the show been on? It's, uh, we're, we're, yeah, you've done oh, three oh, best of. It's a documentary. It's a. It's a it's, we've done three best of shows. I see Patrice going. Welcome six. to Volume Three, the best of Web Junk. I'm like, the show just got on. It's be, the reason I exist on that show. Is because they have to have a reason to show the clips. Right. That's the only reason I'm mm-hmm. there. They, ha- I have to go. Hey, folks, this is why. And yeah. They, oh, and the ones they show again are ones that they can show again. Yeah. They can't just fucking frivolously show shit. I'm hanging by a thread by that. <laughs> they had to go to like fucking, you know, they had to go to a top secret place in like Alaska to go fish for like. A season's worth of a new shit. Yeah, new I, uh, new videos. I love doing it, but I, I, I it's just I don't you think, think it's that the, the well is it, gonna run a, dry. It's a, it's a shelf life because yeah. they did a contest. Come on, everybody, shoot <laughs> the video. Send it, please. Bunch of idiots, motherfuckers are just uncreative. This country sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, give us a video. Everybody's pretend shooting this over the head and flying around, and yeah, it's like, oh, it fucking stinks. Stink. Let's go to Mike. Mike, what's up? Hey, uh, I heard Dice's side. He, he said that he's pissed that 
Opie flipped out the night at the Garden about Man Cow coming out to announce him, and he said that you cursed out. You know, you were cursing and screaming in front of his little kids, and you disrespected his kids. And he doesn't, oh, what a lie! He doesn't stand for that, and Mike, that was uh, Mike. You know, the, one of the big problems that yeah. he had with you, Mike. There was a problem with uh, Man Cow because uh, you know uh, Man Cow was invited to New York City, Madison Square Garden for the Dice Show, okay? Which, that right there is a huge problem. We're arch enemies. The guy's a fucking asshole. And, yeah, and I, I don't even want to get into that part of it, okay? And then, uh, uh, Man Cow is on f uh, Fox and Friends announcing, because he knows it would get to us, and, and busting yeah. our balls saying that he's sponsoring Dice in New I'm York City. I'm uh, presenting Dice over here at uh, Madison Square Garden. Shut up. So, you know, obviously he could not be at the garden and we explained that to dice and we explained to it uh, on air got heated a little bit here's what i i would i would have to say if he had a problem that day why didn't he bring it up with us we ended up having a relationship that, that lasted another two or three years after that thing after well, that well, garden show well, why didn't he bring it up when it was hot what you know but he could have brought it up when i was in la hanging out in his apartment after he got kicked out of his house when we were well, hanging out at gold's gym uh lifting when we went and uh, climbed the mountain, the stupid little molehill that he calls the mountain. Yeah, Want to well, climb the mountain? He's full, so, he's full of shit because he says that he confronted you about it. He, he called you out. He said you want to go at it or whatever. That's such and you, a And he, then he said, you know, you pussy didn't pound, didn't do nothing. And Anthony tried to intervene, oh. and he said he put your ass down. You know, right, See, that's, right that, that tells how much bullshit it is right there because I don't get involved with anybody. Yeah, I was he, I was he, fucking well, drinking. Obviously he's, Mike. You know, he's bullshitting about that that part. Mike. But did, did you see that what he looks like? He looks like a mess. Well, His fucking head is receding back. He's got an eight head. <laughs> I, I kind of feel sorry for him that he had to go down that road, but, you know, I... He is not a little like Don Rickles. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you hockey puck. Is he, huh? he's but it's puck. all about the love, people. He's wearing, he's wearing those fucking weightlifting gloves. <laughs> like, what the fuck is... Well, <laughs> weightlifting gloves on stage. That's <laughs> great. I might, I might do comedy. I might just work out. You can watch me. You know, jake that, off. You know what he says is really ridiculous that that he made you guys popular in New York. You were nothing until he started doing your show. Like, what the we fuck did great fuck? radio yeah. with the guy, but we were very successful before sure. Dice uh, came aboard. Way we don't before, have to we don't have to defend that. And uh, as far as uh, this confrontation that I swear to you never happened after the Garden Show, he's, he grabbed me. He's like, "Come on!" And we w walked in the middle of Madison Square Garden. It was completely empty after the concert let out, and we're taking pictures. Can together. I kiss you on the mouth? And he had tears <laughs> in his eyes. He goes, you don't understand how how uh, you know how important this was to me that my kids were able to see me at Madison Square Garden because the first time I did it, they were either too young or not even born. I don't know exactly what he said about that, but they obviously weren't you know uh, around or or big enough to appreciate it. And then we had a relationship that lasted easily two or three more years after that. I was in every time I went to L.A., I hung out with him uh, in the comedy store and all that. Remember, he wanted to help you decorate. Yeah, you know what? He's full of shit because he says from day one he thought you were an asshole when he met you guys when you uh, when you came in the studio. You know, it's so you know, easy. Obviously, he's bull you know, he's... Dude, Mike, he's it's so easy to is. say Opie's an asshole, but you know what? He he knows that's not true. He sent flowers to my dad's uh, uh, wake. You know, I mean, the guy's ridiculous. I don't know why he decided to turn. I guess he's desperate to get his name back up there and uh, attempt to go, you know, get back on top. Oh. Because all well, he was doing, all he was he... doing on uh, Howard was trashing us to sell a few extra tickets at Governor's. That's pathetic to me. Well, I think he's just he's trashing you guys because he knows Howard hates you, and I think he's just trying to kiss Howard's ass now to, you know, to be back on his show, you know, and dude it... and. Uh, you know, get on his good side. We were in a, his apartment in L.A. We went to the grocery store, and everyone was recognizing him after we went to, you know, Gold's Gym. I was out there for a while, so I hung out with him all day. And then we're at his apartment. He's making, like, it's pretty funny, actually. He's making, like, chicken stir-fry for, for me and stuff. And then we're sitting around talking about his family, his kids. And he's showing me, like, videotape of this reality project that he uh, was doing at the time, which honestly was really good, but no one really, no one picked it up. But it was really, really entertaining and fun. Because he's burnt every bridge. And he was asking me, uh, you know, what I thought of it and all that stuff. All that stuff. What do you think? <laughs> so, huh? you're here. So I, all right, guys, punch it out. I honestly don't know why he turned, but he did. And, you know, good luck to you. Good luck to you. It's like a mad dog. <clears throat> he just turned. And we shot him in the head. He's done.
Dave anyway, Tice. Alan, Dave, what are we plugging today? Uh, I guess I'm, a, I'm still plugging the book. I don't know, you know. Uh, story of the Beastie Boys. The skills, skills to pay, to pay the, the bills. bills. Story of the Beastie Boys. And, and we uh, got into this last time. You don't watch American Idol? I don't watch American Idol. I got too much going on. They were uh, doing this whole queen. Too much going on. <laughs> Thanks. I Make us sound like we got nothing uh, going on. Well, you're a music guy. You got no DVR? I'm a music guy. I you don't might think be able to write anything. A, to... You might be able to write something about it. I, hard to look at American Idol as a music uh, story. You don't no, think you know. one a freak on the fluke chance that one person might actually be talented on that show. If one person's good, we'll find out about them, you know, one way or another. They're going to, mm. you know, they're all, they're all getting Not a, a big shot, Clay you know? Aiken fan, are you? Look, I can't, it is, you know, it is what it is. It's a, con, you know, it's a contest. Clay Aiken's going to be a footnote in music, and Ruben, I don't think so, man. Ruben's going to be a footnote. Ruben. Ruben is, and the black ones are. <clears throat> what is that? Because <laughs> it's a black-white thing. It's always a black-white well, thing. Well, hey, we won't make it one. Hey, you know what? Everybody <laughs> gonna do good, you motherfuckers. It don't exist. Try to make me Mr. Black and White, but I'm just telling you, Rue was in deep shit. Clay Aiken was out to, he was doing what he was. Listen, motherfuckers, the, 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 the show is fucking rigged so that you can't, black people can't really succeed on the fucking show. Really? <laughs> it's despicable. Come on. But how do they win First and of all, then not. How the fuck do you have, what's her name, Priceless? Uh. Price. Oh, oh, Mandisa? No, th that bitch, that, come on, you know that, as a white man, you gotta watch that shit go, that was fucked up. What that was fucked up, but, but I, I think that's because it, y you split the black vote. I think you had to, you know, you there got... Is, there is no black vote. You got the little kid, Paris. That's why they look like a is. whore last night. Yeah, it's just well, like a little whore. She looked like a fucking, uh, a white groupie from a, from a, uh, uh... <laughs> she looked like... From <laughs> Twisted Sister video. <laughs> she looked like she was 37 years they old got last confused. night. They confused. Yeah. But what, why would you have people sing shit that they wouldn't want to ever fucking sing? Right. And why wouldn't you have people vote for the worst performer? Yeah. Not the best, because if the best, you're always going to have more white people fucking voting. There's more white people. So they're going to vote for the best. They're going to vote for who they want. Would you like us to move somewhere? No, I'm just Maybe saying, leave the vote country. for the worst so mm -hmm. that Mandisa would never be in the fucking bottom three. Right? Hey, you I, got got the show. <laughs> no, I got I, no fight with the show. But I agree with you. Hey, Ruben this won. Bullshit. I mean, uh, look, in this country, he you're, was just a judge, you're, you're only you're not. No one notices skin color in this country. Because Clay Aiken, <laughs> Clay Aiken's a sissy. Yeah, that's why this country's more comfortable with blacks than they are with sissies. Find that hard to believe. Now. Yeah, you know, I just think that they are. Sissies Would you never rather... take your car and drive away with it? <laughs> <laughs> Bring it back all clean. <laughs> I never had a fucking gang of sissies chase me into traffic and fucking... Oh, yes, you have. No. They just would dress like women. <laughs> <laughs> One took my glasses. Snatched the glasses off your head, yo. <laughs> For wasting my time. I'm just saying, I watch, well, I watch it. Oh, I watch the fucking show, man. And it, and it, and it, is it, that all pudding on the ceiling? But we got the pudding on? What is yes. this? It, it's a big yeah, no sear of pudding way. on the ceiling tile. You rock, that's, that's pudding? Good. Yeah. That's Holy good. mackerel. Remember that old joke? I'm just wondering how he got his asshole up that high. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I guess you don't. <laughs> but the now, qu the Queen stuff last night was just a complete waste of time. Oh, it, it was it was it was. No sad. one's gonna be able to sing Hard. like Freddie Mercury ever, no. unless you you know why kick yourself in the balls before you, tell me why you hit they the do stage. That, please? Can you tell me why they have you sing in fucking genres? No one has to sing in a genre when you're trying to make it. I know. If they do a comedy competition, you don't go. All right, we're gonna now, we're gonna do George Carlin stuff yeah. today. You know. And uh, or they're going to bring out <clears throat> props. Now, you got to do some prop comedy, now, why? Patrice. We're going to give you a trunk with some stuff. This is exactly what it would be. We're going to give you a trunk. And uh, Gallagher's going to come out, and he's going to help you and coach you on how to do prop comedy. Get the fuck out of here. That'll be fun, actually. No, stupid. The Take the hammer and put it over your head. You don't do the over the shoulder. You ever yeah. see me do over the shoulder? I'd, I'd hit him in the head so hard. <laughs> you see what Kenny Rogers, and I know you must have talked oh, about it, but Kenny, Kenny Rogers, Rogers with his makeover t saying, you Ooh. know, man, is like, you know, singing fat bitch songs, you know yeah. what I mean? What you want? And she's like, yeah. he's like, pronounce the L's. <laughs> On what? the country, the story. What? I'm like, you fucking, you fucking up these people's minds. Mm -hmm. You fucking up their minds. Look at, and your boy got to go. I was in Alabama last oh. week. Uh, Bucky. No, Ace. Chris Autry. 
Retard. Uh, uh, Kevin? Thank you, thank you very much. Uh, Kevin? Uh, take me home. I don't know the, the name. Oh, oh, Taylor thing. Hicks? He's got to go. Taylor he ain't going Taylor anywhere. Taylor ain't going nowhere. He, he, he sucks. He's going to be in the bottom. If he's I don't in the bottom three, I'm a boy. I don't agree show. with you. I, I mean, I, I do agree with you, but I don't he think going he's going anywhere. The, the American people love shit like that. They're they gonna sit get rid there of, and go, God damn, he's funny. They're going to get rid of Ace. He's God damn funny. They're going to get rid of Ace and Elliot before uh, Taylor yeah. Hicks goes. Ace even has though, to even go. Even though Elliot's probably a, a much better singer. I, I, and I feel bad for Ace because you know he's out of here because he's been in the bottom three for a while. But who, it's about time, who makes yeah. uh, We Will Rock You their own? Yeah, I know. How you're, the fuck you, do you un karaoke? We it's a karaoke song to begin with. Right. He had balls too because he goes to Brian May. I want to change the arrangement of the song and, and Brian, Brian May. Like, what? No, <laughs> I ain't changing <laughs> yourself. I, I'm not changing anything. <laughs> it's like, first of all, Mr. May, you ain't shit without that sissy Freddie <laughs> Mercury. Let's be honest. <laughs> he had a very shit. distinctive uh, guitar sound, Patrice. <laughs> and then and when George Michael stepped in, it was fine. And then Paris looking like she's 37 now with those I, hair I, extensions. I, how did what she was go that from, about? From oh my God, she can't lose to poor baby. Thank you, Sammy. And Kelly Pickler is so is completely uh, faking this. She's playing this stupid angle. She's a you know on paper it looks good, paper? and then she goes she goes what uh, what is on paper? What's Look, you're not that stupid. You can't possibly. She's got be. a little stupid in her, and someone said yeah. the stupid thing is working. I would I would continue with that. That's all that's about. Yeah. You don't work know what the on stupid paper angle. means? Work the stupid angle See, it's working for This is for why you. this is not a music. I mean, that's the thing. Like, no, uh, uh, everything they've achieved is amazing, but it's all, you know. But now you get or somebody like. Who looks like what? Who's the, how do you play the you voters? Song. How are you it's doing? The, that's cool. That's TV, and it's, oh, they're killing everybody. But isn't but that what music is about? The image that the person has? There could be sure. some of the best singers in the world. You know, farming somewhere in Nebraska, and they'll never get the chance no to, question. to show themselves. Yeah. And it is about personality, how you present yourself, how you look, how you act on stage, uh, if you can relate with a crowd. Like that guy, Chris, is really a great singer. This guy's voice is amazing. Which and, one's that, the rocker? Yeah. yeah. And, he's, and, and he has a thing where, like, a guy like that, you would hope he quits. Just leave the show because and sign with somebody. He has a thing where he just seems you know professional. What, he has yeah. a movement that, like he's a pro, you know? American Idol's protected against that these days. I bet you can't quit the show at all. They've already signed. I think once you get to the top 20, well, they first, all have to sign exclusive One of the deals. seasons, someone did quit because they knew they were better off if they quit. Yeah, who, so they who, got was, away that? With... who was that? Uh, exactly. <laughs> no, you're right. Is that the Good. guy that was banging Paul Abdul? No, no it's... there was another Puerto Rican kid with a cat in the different yeah. from New York. Yep. Hey, hold on a minute. We got to say hi. We can't let a big star wait. Dennis Larry. Hey, guys. Hey, How are you, guys. buddy? I'm all right. How you doing? Can I? Uh, I was just, uh, it's Opie talking. I was just on vacation, and I got to admit, I'm the last person to see Ice Age. I finally saw it. <laughs> the original. Get out of here. I You're swear. not the last person. There's plenty of people out there that need to go to see this movie. No, no, no he's no, talking no. about the talking first about one. Million dollars. Dennis, Dennis, Dennis. Den I know there's more money. Dennis, you're not listening. I'm, I'm, I'm talking about I'm talking about the first one. The first one oh, he didn't see. The first one. Jesus Christ. I, I know. Jesus. And you know how many times you've come in and I, I make believe I, I, I saw it? <laughs> you liar. You low-down, dirty liar. I got to tell you, though, man, that movie was great. Yeah. Well, let me tell you something. The second one's even funnier. Yeah. Let me tell you something else. The third one? Jesus is dead. It's going to be great. You don't need to celebrate Easter, okay? Ice Age is alive, all right? <laughs> go there. Go see Ice Age. I, actually, Jesus is in Ice Age. If you go to Ice Age 2, it counts as going to Mass if you're a Catholic. <laughs> how, okay? e how easy a gig is that? Yeah, yeah, you go to see the movie, and you uh, celebrate uh, Easter at the same time. I'll tell you how popular the, the, the new Ice Age movie is. It's making Dennis so big that he doesn't need to come in here anymore. Now he just gives us a call. A little phone. You know guys, I apologize for that. I'm just in the middle of this you know, goddamn giant you know, press tour, and I, I obviously would love to be in the studio with you guys because I always have a good time there. Yeah. And I'm good at uh, predicting the future. Ice Age 3 comes out. You forgot who we were. Ice Age 3, <laughs> like Ice Age 3 comes out. I, I basically uh, retire. Yeah. <laughs> I saw if you in the makes as much money as this one. I'm done. All saw right? you in the paper the other day in your little <laughs> fireman suit. Hey. Yeah. Hey. When does Rescue Me uh, start back up? May 30th. Season three starts. We're shooting it right now. Uh, the second week in May, the second season DVD comes out. The third week in May, the Rescue Me soundtrack comes out. Any black uh, characters, Dennis? Oh, Who? yeah. 
Any black characters? Yes, people after the fire. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jesus. Is that Jim Norton? Of course Hi, it Dennis. is. Well, and I'll Patrice O'Neill. I was just wondering, Dennis. You know, hey, man. How you doing, man? Two funny sons of bitches. I mean, you throw me in a lot of stuff, but, you know, that that that, that uh, rescue me, boy. That's yeah. A, Boy, hey, that you know, be a feather in my cap. That's man. a nice one, right? Man, oh you can man. tell VH want to go screw themselves oh, with their web, dumb web, web junk. Web junk my dick. <laughs> <laughs> with you a know, little rescue. I got to tell you, man, I watch that show with my kids all the time, and we laugh our asses off. What's yeah. your favorite clip? Uh, my favorite clip, so, oh, man, that would be a hard thing to pick, but, um, oh, man, I would have to say... Uh, <laughs> The uh, <laughs> why you put that? really hard. To he's get. on the way. He's on the website right now. <laughs> Typing like a motherfucker. <laughs> he just smacked his son in the head. Go get the fucking. <laughs> There's so many funny fucking yeah. clips. It is head is humming a humming a humming. Yeah. <laughs> you can see you them know? at ogres. dot com. <laughs> that, um, that, that's with the uh, yeah Chinese kid. Oh, good. Yeah. Good. yeah that, that's, I mean, that's all right. That's now, how do you do that? They, they, they they find the clips and then you just go in and you kind of talk off the top of your head. No, I don't. Um, I I I talk a little bit off the top of my head, a yeah. lot off the top of my head, but yeah, eventually that shit will you'll die. What, you run out. Yeah, so they'll go, hey man, how about this angle? You know, it's a you know the little Chinese kid or whatever he was talking now, with the little you know, actress how many, how girl was really funny. Like once a week to do it. Twice, eight. It takes sixteen hours. Dakota to to Fanning. It. Sixteen That's hours a week. Gig. Yeah, just, just cause, you know. Man, really? Working harder than us a week. Jesus, what are you doing? Well, I have to fucking because you, you you say you go, so Here's much this stuff. thing. Look at this funny like guy. I say something that I think is a gem. I'm like, oh, look at that little gook just falling out. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah. I say, beat gook, you know? And they go, ah, you can't beat. You can't just you can't, you can't say gook. <laughs> You can say that. Ah, uh, no, you can't. <laughs> they won't allow it. You know, look at these chinks abusing women. Because that's all they do to fucking chick. That's what they did. They put, like, a piece of meat how on 16 the, bitches' heads. How about heads. the lady with the ass? The Chinese lady with the, the, the uh, oh. ass thing? Oh, breaking the nuts or oh something, right? Oh, my God. Cracking the nuts open? What the hell is that about? No. She was, she was European or German. How do you discover that talent? You know what I mean? Mm. You know, I think Dennis is telling me that my future lies in Web Junk 20. Fuck. Uh, I don't think he's letting you on. Uh, is in my future, dude. Web Junk, Rescue Web me. Junk is When's the last time you stone. saw a black New York fireman? It's a stepping stone to the to the Patrice O'Neill empire that will occur at some point in the future, We're ladies and gentlemen. Attorney. They Listen, might man. be a little racist there. Yeah, I think the Patrice O'Neill channel is in the future where you just Ooh. wake up if, and we have Patrice O'Neill 24 hours a day. If I, I had to... If I had to... Span of a white guy, I would agree with you, but it's got to happen soon. Yes. <laughs> I am <laughs> Mabel O'Neill. I'm fucking Ronnie Dangerfield's age. <laughs> in white, in, white in years. white years, nigga. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Shit, man. I can't. I can't. You know how many around. people ask Dennis to be on that show, though? It doesn't it, matter. It can't, you can't he imagine. Give a shit about the other people asking. I have a, his, I have a history with the. He, he yeah. I have a history with the with uh, 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 I forgot the company. Fucking Serpico and him. Yeah, yeah. Dennis, apostle. the apostle. Apostle got yeah. a history with apostle. Mm -hmm. So they, you know, I, I'm fucking around really because they give me. They hook me up. They're the first. They're the first people that ever just put me on shit. You know, I, you, you know, I mean, just people just. They yeah. just put you in stuff. We have a history with Apostle, too. You don't see us being suicide guy from the roof saying, don't jump, don't jump on the show. Or... <laughs> yeah. I mean, you, you have a history got, with Apostle? I said, I yeah, we've before. done a few meetings with Apostle. I've said this before, and I'll say it again. Yes, Chris then. is one of the funniest motherfuckers <laughs> that has ever walked this planet. They don't, I don't, no bullshit, this motherfucker, no bullshit, I wrote, did you ever get that letter I wrote? It was yeah, really man, it was a nice letter. It, it, it was in for, I, Ireland, he took me, took me to Ireland, 10,000, I played the most people I've ever been in front of, <laughs> and then uh, the the last um, Boston, the um, Comics it, Come Home was Avery, the second Avery highest. Fisher Hall. It, which was that? No. That was in New York. Oh, the shit! That was Lincoln huge! Lincoln Center? Fucking, uh... Isn't that uh, ironic? It's the Lincoln I'm Center? I'm thinking of Boston, Massachusetts, I'm mm. thinking, Lincoln Center? Uh, Carnegie Hall. Carnegie Hall. A lot of big shit, man. They hook me up with a lot. Like you don't, and you don't even think mm -hmm. about it because he just because Dennis never talks to me. <laughs> it's always um, it's just impossible. <laughs> yeah. It's coming from Dennis. <laughs> you don't He's talk the to me. Don. Dennis is one of those guys. He you gets know, his capos to talk <laughs> to you. You don't want to talk to too much. <laughs> he just go, hey man, you're a funny guy. Thanks, Dennis. And he just goes, get out of my fucking face. You can feel it. Yeah, but you know what? Feel I took the three. I took the three to Ireland. We did the biggest gig in in uh, a comedy gig in European history. It was ten thousand oh, people. Oh, it was amazing, right? dude. This Jesus motherfucker Christ. goes on stage and he opens up with a bit which was true. 
because he, he'd been there many times before. He, do, he opens up with 10 minutes about how Ireland, because they're becoming an economic booming country, has discovered its own form of racism. And he fucking slays the room with it. That's what I love about him. He comes on stage in Boston in front of 8,000 people wearing a fucking Yankees hat. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what a set of fucking balls. He does five minutes about how black people wear a Yankees hat because it matches their socks. Not because they're Yankees hat. Well, he's, he he's wearing his A's gear today because uh, that's the latest thing. <laughs> this is what Can't name doing? one player on the team, but he likes the green. <laughs> Dennis, head to toe uh, with Oakland A's stuff on. <laughs> green yeah, well, you know what? Hey, man, it's a fashion. Like he said, black people wear it because it's a fashion statement. Yep. White people wear it because it's my team, man. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. Fucking white idiots are out there with the Yankees hats on, even though they got a shirt that doesn't match the hat. Yeah, not, not many people with the B hats on, though. Oh, man. That's good I'll that you take you. care of comedians, though, certain ones, you know? <laughs> <laughs> no, but he's he's more East Coast. Doesn't, um... Yeah, I wasn't what do carrying you think I tours, you know? He's talking about himself there, Patrice. Jim and Norton uh, want talking some about love from the East Coast, Jim's too. a West Coast guy now. Now he is. He's yeah, sneaky you're right. West. He's sneaky West Coast. Yeah. He's Once packing that... his shit. <laughs> oh, yeah. Jim has, Jim's packing his Once shit. Once that series comes out. I actually got to leave him at the catch a plane to the coast. It's funny. <laughs> 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 See? Hey, guys, I got to roll because I got a, a bunch of press to do. But but I thought we were having fun. They're man. telling us you got to hey, go. When I do, when Rescue Me comes out, I'll come over. bring some of the guys. We'll come over to the studio. I'll bring Lenny. You do that. Yeah, we great. love Lenny. All right. All right. Cool. All right, All right Dennis. Bye. Thanks, man. Thanks for the quick call, Dennis. Bye. Dennis Leary, Bye. everyone. Go see Ice Age. See? Let's, I want a graph. I want a graph of Ooh. Dennis's appearances on this program based on time and uh, in-studio and phoner. Who's the biggest star? And we'll watch that it. Joe fucks with you guys. We'll watch it go down that could like be Citadel the last time. stock. I think that, you. <laughs> Who's the, yeah. who's the biggest? Who's the biggest star? Seriously, who's the biggest, biggest star, star that still like just fucking calls in or comes in or it's whatever? Be Dennis Leary, think about it. I would think Dennis as a regular yeah, guy. Ranks, Dennis ranks Leary, right but up I, there. I bet you that's the last time he. Uh, yeah, you just heard the last the time Dennis has been on the Opie and Anthony show. Second Ice Age movies blowing up. Rescue yeah, Me yeah. is, is he coming the producer out? or something? What? Is he the producer of Ice yeah, he, he, I'm so sure he got a great those a nice deal to c come back to the second a one. a fortune for the voice people, and it's no work. The cartoons? I, I would love to yeah. just stay and I quit comedy if I could just do voiceovers. Hey, would that be great? It's the greatest. Hey, what do you say we go down the valley and try to go this way? <laughs> Hire me, please. And What's wrong with that? And Why is that any different from anything else? And reading it. Yeah. Reading. <laughs> it's reading. Do you know how fucking lazy I was? Just, uh, movies on the big screen. Just reading <laughs> is fucking voiceover. If somebody tells you voiceover work is, I used to do so. I used to do voiceover. Something used to come on noggin. Um, I forgot noggin. Uh, noggin. That's uh, that little kitty channel. Uh, yes. If they knew who I was, it I know. Happen. Uh, uh, uh O'Grady High. I used to lay on the floor. In the fucking booth. <laughs> I used to lay on the floor and have my and set up my paperwork and lay like with my hand on my and read the fucking because it was that easy. Oh, Some, someone that. tells me there wasn't a lot of noggin money though going around. Well, it yeah. was no, but it was where you would if you were being paid a lot. <clears throat> you're coming in a suit. <clears throat> yes, I'm here to do my voiceover work. Once you get the hang, really, what m amount of money would make you change who you were? Like if somebody said, "Here's a billion, throw me out a number," you would a billion dollars. You still be right. Anthony. Hey, this is you why wouldn't, you'd never notice it though. <laughs> Who came up with this? Change in a Iraq? second. I'm a sellout motherfucker. I gotta. I, uh, change, e Rock. Change it back to Dennis for a second. E Rock did a little research. Okay. okay. Dennis Leary uh, has done our show three times, mm -hmm. probably three times since on we've been on XM, XM. Okay. and he did it a, a few times at the old joint. Okay. First time he was on was uh, June 28th, 05. Okay. He was on for 45 minutes. 45 minutes. Oh shit. Second time. Live in studio. Live in studio. All right. Second time, mm -hmm. uh, eleven thirty oh five. Mm -hmm. He was on for a little over an hour. So oh, wow, we 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 had to bump up. Okay. Uh huh. Now since that last appearance, let's remember, Ice Age blew up. Obviously, yep. the the second movie is now out and Rescue Me. Today he was on for eight minutes. Eight minutes by <laughs> phone. <laughs> That's a mistake, though. He, that's that's the extenuating circumstances. You, you got to give him one more chance. One more chance. For a half hour. Okay. You, one more. <laughs> I want to see the letter you wrote to Dennis. Oh, it was heartwarming. And where's our letter? 
Yeah. We've done well, some things not, for I'm you. I'm not done yet with you guys. <laughs> what are you fucking... <laughs> that was a fucking... I, I want a letter. See you again letter. That was a pretty much thank you, <laughs> very, very goodbye. Yeah, that but was she's like, going to feel real good and finally write that letter thinking that we're going to take it seriously and it'll be right up on openatnight.com. Uh, Look what Patrice wrote us. Uh, whack bag. Patrice is a faggot. <laughs> <laughs> but I've left faggy messages for, um, for Opie. Yeah, for Opie. I don't have your number. I now, how do you not have my number? I just think it's it's just useless to call you. It's useless it to call is. Opie, but it's probably more double useless to call you. I gotta I gotta yeah. tell you, Patrice O'Neill is very appreciative. Let me tell you, I'm a fun call, by the way. Uh, I'm also helpful. I can imagine call. Hey, hey, Anthony, what's up, man? Yeah, what? Who, who's this? It's Patrice. What's going on? I would know just because <clears throat> I'd hear it was a black guy. I'd know it's you. Because <clears throat> I don't know any other black people. I have people. a feeling Anthony would go. What? Uh, it'll be uncomfortable silence, and then like a. What the? What's up, dude? <laughs> what's going on? What's uh? Oh, hey, Patrice, what's up? Oh, and then you'd hear shit. in the background, like I'm just going about my business, playing video game. You'd hear pew pew pew. I was gone. on. I was just. I was on one was, day on Pound Talk. He was giving a fucking yeah. uh, a, a tour of your of your home. I was my new uh, thing. I was showing all the boxes. I was like, this motherfucker. If I called him, but I've called Opie. I'm gonna call Opie. I left him a lot of messages. Like after the yeah. Black Phillips show, I was like, That Man. tells you something right there. You said, I've left him a lot of messages. No, no, well, we've talked a lot. Get, yeah, yeah. You'll, you'll get back. Wait a minute, Patrice. Help me out here. I call what? you back a lot. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Because Ope never really, every, every 90% of the time, the phone won't pick up. But yeah, I'm very, I'm very like, I don't want to be the motherfucker bothering people. Mm -hmm. So I'll only call once. So I can't really say you won't get yeah, back. And, I, and no, I have a message guy. that says, listen, I'll try to get back to you. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's, it's probably not going to happen. But See, you know, so I don't take it personal, you know what I mean, when people right, call you back. We do have to take a break because uh, we got Alan Light here. And um, also, remember we started the show with that intern Tommy? Who? This Stephen Wright guy. Oh, right. So, uh, Than got some Stephen Wright jokes together for him. And we'll see. I, I, I hope he didn't guys wake in up. I Boston because I have to leave. You I gotta, gotta catch mother. Coast. You know how it is. Jimmy. We're shooting. Gotta go. But Jimmy. Jimmy. But uh, no, I miss my friends. I, where where are you going? LA? LA. And when, no when, when is your LA. flight? One fifteen. One fifteen. It's only ten. I have an eleven fifteen pickup, so I'll go home. Eleven fifteen. Yeah. You all packed? Ninety five percent. Yeah. yeah. I gotta put like my my nose stuff and a couple of things. The, the, so you're gonna fly to Boston to do our show? No, I'm gonna fly our back show to New York and go up with you. I'm is driving it? you up. I may. Well, I think they're actually actually I may give me the room the day early because I may have to fly in. I might leave first class. I might leave Friday though. First class. If for my first class, of course, I sorry. would laugh at NBC if they fly there. Oh, they trying to find a coach. Do you do the? Uh, do you have your uh, gold status or platinum? Gold. <laughs> platinum. Oh, platinum. Yeah, platinum yeah. status. Yeah, I know. Yeah, uh, maybe I will fly on Friday. Though. I'll see if I can switch the flight to go through uh, Houston. I'm just uh, warning you. I might go up Friday. Well, I'm I mean, not I, even kidding. Uh, then maybe I'll have. Uh, well, maybe I'll have Donnie get me the room. And I'll, I'll tell Don right, we'll to sweet, and I'll, I'll have I'll just switch the flight, and I'll fly right in from the coast. Get the hell out of here! Oh, you'll fly right into Boston. You're I'll disgusting. fly in from the coast. I'll take a quick connection. Just make sure the suite's set up in the car. That's all. Oh. I'm ready to go. Ugh. Oh, I know. I won't have enough clothes. Fuck. Speaking of people oh, leaving go, the show, just buy so. some. Just go buy some at the mall. Have yeah. them close. Have them close you know the store down. Yeah. I'll have Kenny tell him I'm coming. Close the store down and get me a few items. Could you close the store? Mr. Norton would like to. Who? Who? <laughs> Opie and Anthony. <laughs> Two guys from. I'm the cop that got in trouble. <laughs> oh, you, okay. It was funny watching Kenny explain that, and the more details you have to give, the less you know somebody recognizes you. Yeah. You know, from, from New Jersey. You know, I told dirty jokes. <laughs> you know, no one knows you. No one knows. <laughs> You're not Lenny Bruce. <laughs> Dude, I've done that exact thing with our St. Pat's. Yeah. You know. They either know right away or they have no clue. Oh, and, they don't. And, and you're like, why am I explaining this? They Kenny, don't know. Kenny's the only cop who had a mullet. Ah, <laughs> right. uh, oh, I know you. Yeah, that, that is the, you know, the guy with the mullet. I have a mullet and a tapering head. Yes. <laughs> All right, I'm going to leave Stupid myself. cop mustache. Jim Norton, have fun in L.A. We'll see you in Boston when we broadcast live Monday, I think, we're broadcasting live from Boston. Yeah. Bill's Bar, Marathon, is it? Marathon, Monday. I don't even know. Lansdowne Street. Dude. Sounds good. Are you really going up Friday? Maybe. I didn't know that. All right, I'll try to wait for you. Wow, you're going, going to my hometown. Holy yeah. shit. Tell Why don't you come with us? Tell everybody to say hi. You should. You should come up to Boston, man. I miss my mom. Come up with all of us. Nice to visit my mommy. Mm. Can I... Can someone point oh, to Derek? Point. If my plane doesn't crash. Now we all know that Opie and Anthony Wow stickers are your ticket to seeing some beautiful bosoms. Well, yeah. Did you know that Wow stickers have many other uses? I sliced out both my kidneys and I patched up the wounds with Wow stickers. But, but, dude, 
How do you pee? Oh, boy. Can't pee. This was incredibly nearsighted. Get your official Opie and Anthony wow stickers at opianthony.com. Gotta go pee, can't go pee, gotta go pee, can't go pee, pee pee dance, pee pee dance, gotta go pee, can't go pee. I banned you before, motherfucker. You're checking out the Opie and Anthony program. You are so banned, you stupid cocksucker. <laughs> you are so banned. Anthony's in a mood today. Patrice O'Neill in studio. He's going to do the rest of the week with us, and we couldn't be happier. Alan Light in studio. Stones playing behind us. They censored the Stones in China. They finally they finally got there and finally got the show. I think they knew uh, there were going to be some limitations going in. Yeah, because they're making a big deal because it's censorship, obviously. But you got to think if you're going to play China that you're not yeah, going to... Yeah, that was not a surprise. You're not gonna hey, be they censored to... them on the Super Bowl, so, you know. Let's... That was that was so <laughs> ridiculous. What are they have to go to China to get censored. So they, uh, they, they couldn't play, what, four or five songs over there? Yeah, something like that. I mean, they were going to go a few songs? years ago. I don't know. It was... Uh... One of the new songs and a couple of the old songs. Ah, okay. <laughs> I forget which ones. Yeah, I don't remember. Like it the matters, and like Mick yeah. Jagger cared. Well, he did back uh, way back uh, in the Ed Sullivan days. He cared. What's what's the matter? Are you, are you saying maybe he doesn't have the same passion for it, and it's no, all about the cash? It's and China. The... I think it's a, just a huge accomplishment just to be able to say, "Wow, we played China." Yeah. Who would have thought that would have ever happened? Right. Right. And you they know. could do most of the set. They could do the, you know. got a catalog. You pick your, you pick your spots. Songs yeah. big, yeah. so they couldn't play four or five. I don't think Mick Jagger, who, yeah, he's all for that. I'd like to know which ones, though, and why the government God, bring them. Ben in. Ben yeah. knows. Like ben. Ben. ben knows. I should know. I'm, it's, it's wrong that I don't know. He's keeping it under his hat, though, with, with a <laughs> cement mixer. Come on, Ben. Where are you? He was just ben. in here. Ben. Ben. Here, Ben. Ben, come on, boy. <laughs> What's wrong, come on, Patrice? Ben. Come on, boy. Come on, Ben. <laughs> What's wrong, Patrice? Come here, Ben. Come on, Ben. So fucked up. In the Dude, <laughs> the worst part about come it. Come on, Ben. Oh, good, good boy, Ben. Come here, Ben. Oh, Be good boy. God. The worst part about it, we're struggling a little bit here on the air. He, he, I just saw him way in the background near oh, the know. office. Just puts up a finger like one minute. One minute. All right, we'll sweat for another minute here live on the on, Here he on the comes. Air. Good boy. <laughs> oh, 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 my God. <laughs> oh, you Earl. I thought you knew the song's off the top of your head. Oh, Earl's here? Yeah. Then bring Earl in. Earl, no, Earl would absolutely know. Come on. Come on, Earl. I know Satisfaction is one. It was like five yeah. with my Earl. Earl, what songs? Uh, Earl, we need to know what songs were banned in China. I think it was uh, Let's Spend the Night Together, Brown Sugar... Uh, Rough Justice. Rough Justice was definitely one of them, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, wow. Why Brown Sugar? The song's about screwing on a slave ship. <laughs> that's about <laughs> sex and the slave trade. Yeah, yeah I can but see, so why you know. do the Chinese have a problem with that? <laughs> no, they have, uh, I, is that what the uh, fuck is about? Can I? I, I didn't on. know either. Oh, we're educating. Hold on. Can I, can I raise my hand? I'm going to raise my hand to and, and oh, everyone right. else. I had no idea. And, and I've been playing that song on the radio oh, my entire life. This is why hooks are so important. <laughs> right. yeah. Tell that he to America. A, he pulls a black naughty head, <laughs> fucks it on the edge of the bowl, and Shoots the cannon off in a black pussy. Brown sugar. We gonna sell a bitch for a dime. Brown sugar. Brown, brown, brown. That means a brown black pussy. Are you fucking? I had no idea. Me? Go back and listen, kids. Yep, dude. Wait, yep. Where does it? Where does it say like that? I think the opening so, was sold on slave on a cotton field. Sold, sold in, in the, the market, market down, down in New Orleans. Orleans. Yeah, but I think that she's there already, right? <laughs> oh my god! I swear to God, I've been playing this song my I've entire life. I had no idea. Ain't <laughs> she there already? <laughs> hold on, I want to hear like the black girl should. All right, hold on. Let's hear the lyrics now. <laughs> I can't believe this is news. 35 years later. 35 years this song Did came you know out. This? I suppose she was a slave, but I didn't know that she... All I know is brown sugar. Mitch Jagger wasn't brave enough to, to sell that lyric, though, man. <laughs> That's the first time I've heard it that way. What? He kind of... Slave. Slave. Bound for a cotton field. So yeah, but, she's on her way. She's but bound for a cotton field. Sold in a market. Sold in a market. Yeah, but he didn't you know, really pronounce it that well. 
Yeah. Because this was what? This came out in the 70s. 1971. 71, okay, so. I don't know. 35 years. And we're saying. still. Listen, listen to it again. What, what happened? <laughs> hey, I don't know. He's whipping her and he then she's dancing she's da- like a young girl should. What should what? He got her to behave. Can we fucking dissect this song, please? I understand what's going on. <laughs> All right, now. Call that, the lyrics up. Call the lyrics up. The plantation up. guy's wife. <laughs> Is like on to wonder where it's gonna stop. They ain't stopping. He's fucking him. He's fucking all the slave girls. He likes the brown sugar. Because he was could. Was this boycotted at some point? In, in... I don't think so. Was this... Did anybody no. notice this? I don't think black people know this shit. No. <laughs> oh. Right now. Ixnay, let's not let them. <laughs> wow. I don't think the black what, people know this. They can't. They can't know this. should be a fucking album from God. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Who knew? We're trying to get the lyrics. <laughs> and no and, and what is what was that that saxophone solo was the fucking? Yeah, that was some, <laughs> some sexy All fucking going on. Yeah, yeah. Gold Coast slave ship bound for cotton fields, sold in the market down in New Orleans. Scared old slaver knows he's doing all right. Hear him whip the women just around with midnight. <laughs> Brown sugar. How come you taste so good? Brown sugar, just like a young girl should. Drums yeah. beating cold. Engl- English blood runs hot. Lady of the house wondering when it's going to stop. Houseboy knows that he's doing all right. You should have heard him just around midnight. Brown sugar tastes so good. I bet your mom was a tent show queen. Black pussy, how yeah. you taste so good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Just like wow. a black girl should. My mm-hmm. God. Motherfucker. I'm going to punch him right in his long tongue. <laughs> Holy jeez. I bet your mama was a Cajun queen and all her boyfriends were sweet 16. I'm no schoolboy, but I know what I like. You should have heard them just around midnight. Just fucking black girls. <laughs> Just like a black girl should. <laughs> I said, See, yeah. then they called him out on some girls. Just like a black yes, girl that's should. that's true. You know what? I, I appreciate these fucking chinks. <laughs> I don't have a that. <laughs> ban that cocksucker. Son wow. of a bitch. How did he get away with that shit? I don't know. It's back in the day. It's back in the day. I'm going to make a song. It was all just like, fun back in the yeah. day. Yeah. Make a song about white women getting raped and just think of a good hook. Um... <laughs> Cotton swabbing. Wait. <laughs> Keep my little Q-tip. 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 It's Did got to start. It's got to. Yes. Patrice attempting a follow-up hit. I think so. I think follow it's up. raining stuff. <laughs> my little Q-tip. <laughs> the answer She's record. parking the a minivan record. to go shopping. I'm putting this in my pocket. <laughs> you better. Uh-oh. He's going to. Look out. He's this bringing that to the community. Yeah. Yeah. This is one of the best kept white secrets ever. <laughs> yeah. And he's now got a copy of uh, the plan. Oh, mm. damn. I'm sitting there going, what the fuck are these Chinese people yapping about? Brown sugar? What, yeah, they don't what, got any sweeteners sugar? over there? Yeah, what's that all about? Oh, they only like white sugar? Mm. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I had no idea. Wow. No idea. I, am, I am stunned. This, again, 1971. We don't pay attention that closely well, to music. Really, that's your job, Alan. eight million times. How many times you heard this song? Heard. Well, I played it on the radio easily two to three thousand times. It. It's hard to understand. You know what's worse? Yeah, well. Kaja Gugu's Too Shy is about the Holocaust. <laughs> and I never knew it. Shy, shy. Hush, <laughs> hush. Uh, yeah, hush, shy, hush. It's hush, hush. So when the gas comes. <laughs> horrible. I don't hear no, nothing about Jew. <laughs> Please shy, don't shy. believe me. Please don't <laughs> believe me, Patrice. <laughs> you could have you could have gotten, you uh, gotten could've, all the way with that. Could have kept it rolling, but <laughs> the, the filth and, and despicable uh, shit that would have had to pour from my mouth to do it. Oh, uh, damn. 99 look what, loaf balloons. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Look the Hindenburg disaster. Look where we started. Yeah. Rashad. Hey, fellas. Hey. What's up, man? Look, I'm a black guy, and I love rock music. I listen to Pantera, Alice in Chains, Nine Inch Nails. I have not a clue of what they're saying. It's a guitar riff, loop, and I'm happy. No idea what they're saying. <laughs> you guys are all just humming along. What, like, what there's, is, your, there's your it's, American it's, Idol. There's the lesson called, for um, American Idol uh, uh, right there. Uh, uh, yeah. uh, the, 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 um, what do you call it? I lost it. The, the, not the riff, but the, the, the hook. The hook. The hook. Yeah. 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 I'm not, yeah. do, 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 and that'll be from New Orleans. New Orleans. That's where music comes from. Little black nigglet. Did he just say nigglet? That was fuck in the ass. Huh? I don't know what he said. Brown sugar. And I'm fuck in the ass. Motherfucker. The words are put together in a way that it sounds like one big word. 
Absolutely. You know? So you really don't realize what he's saying there in the first thing. Lesson Jesus. number go, one. Go, go, baby. She bound for cotta. What? She bound for cotta feel? Motherfucker. She bound for cotta feel. Rohoa should be uh, as clever. What is the motherfuckers? <laughs> What's the Rohoa? Ro <laughs> the white motherfuckers. <laughs> they should just be clever. They can sing all the fucking sing songs they want. Sing any racist stuff you want as long as you make it string it out into one word. <laughs> can you... I, it, mm. Did you know it was a? Uh, uh, I had no idea, dude? no clue. Rashad, thanks for the call. I thought it was just no about. Problem, I knew it was about banging black chicks. That's all I knew. Brown I sugar. figure he likes the brown sugar. I had no clue. He's beating them. They're dancing. I have making no them idea. dance. I didn't even know the hook slave was ship about a black is girl. involved. Yeah. First goddamn first line. That's Gold people... Coast slave ship. Brown that's sugar. why people thought he was evil. Thought he was the devil. That was his. That's that's his thing, right? That was Ooh. his Jagger. That was his. My you know, goodness. People hated Mick Jagger at one point. Oh, he was. You know, he was the. He was the scare. He was the bad boy. He was stirring up controversy, getting banned. Like that's his thing. So I didn't even still, know. I didn't even song wow. written before the, you were born, and it's hook. still shaking you up. I didn't know the hook was about black girls. Like I just, it's just why, well, right, whatever, brown sugar. <laughs> Peggy so Sue's about a lynching? What? <laughs> it's impossible. What? What's I can't get no satisfaction about? That? <laughs> Looks like he was getting all the satisfaction he needed. Huh? I wanted to kill 20 bitches, but I only killed 14. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> yeah. All right. Slave ship. All right. Yeah. Did you wow. guys see the heavy metal uh, movie? Thank God for Earl. Which? Which? The that one that's uh, not even out yet. We got a screener's uh, copy, and we had the guys on. It's a documentary oh, uh, on heavy I know, metal. I, I haven't seen it. I haven't seen it. Earl, you I see it yet? I haven't seen it yet. All right, there goes that. There's that. All right, <laughs> All right. you could X that off. <laughs> we got to get uh, actually Tom in here to do his Stephen Wright. Yeah, I want to hear this. This show start off really weird. Uh, yes. There was no energy. Yes, sir. I'll agree, sir. And uh, we invited this intern in because he has a really red face from the Yankee game yesterday, and and he was speaking monotone. He had no energy whatsoever. None. And he talks like this. And he moves real slow as well, obviously. Where is he? What? Is oh, he? now he's missing. Is he still Big pulling pudding out of his ear? <laughs> look at, look I think at my book's selling. You know, books, there's no sound scan for books. So you just put it out there and wait. And you kind of see what happens. See when the returns come back in and unless it's, you know... Is there, huge, you is don't... there a big book pri pri piracy out there? <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of the bootleg... Uh, yeah, they're yeah. selling them out of duffel bags yeah, on the right. sidewalks. <laughs> yeah, the writers people are, on. People are, are on. downloading. People are downloading <laughs> that for, you yeah, know... the writers are still safe. They're nothing back. Right, is it no, they're still the safe. Sellers list? No, it's, uh, no it's, so you look at, you know, you check your Amazon thing. Two people buy it. It jumps 100,000 places, and then it, you know... You know Do you, you read no your idea. comments? It is the least... It's so anticlimactic putting a book. I'm used to magazine. I was a magazine, been a magazine writer for years. You put a magazine out there. It's out there. You see it everywhere. Who pays you? You get your advance. Then if it sells enough, then when your advance is paid out, so you come back later. Like Stephen King and the Big Boys. No, that's a whole oh. other. That's a that's like a, that's launching a, a that's like launching Mission Impossible and a cereal line and a toy store. I mean, Semi trucks full they, of money. Yeah. Before you even come up with a concept for a book, they just back the, those the guys. truck up with the advance, hand you all of that. Dean Koontz and, then, and all uh, yeah, them. that's. So, but so the book that, business is, is weird because there's you? like, what? no, Koontz that's cool. That's it's you know, those, it's Where entertainment. You know, who's the big uh, boy? Well, those. I Michael mean, Crichton. Who's the biggie biggie? I, when he, I don't think when he turns it on. I mean, I think Stephen King is still. Dan King of the Hill, Brown. right? How many I would say he's dragons? the master of macabre. <laughs> if I could make that up, and Dean maybe Koontz he'll is run up there with, with him, though, man. Uh, Dean yeah. Koontz, he's falling off. I, I think a lot of Stephen King fans don't like Dean Koontz. It's all about yeah. Dan Brown. Dan Brown. What? Dan, Dan Brown. Brown. <laughs> Who's that? Da Vinci Code. Oh, yeah. the Da Vinci yeah, you know Code. That. Only the biggest book ever. Yeah. They should have never made that into a movie because I would never have a chance to read that book now. I'm gonna read it. I, were you gonna, were you gonna read it anyway? Yeah, enough right. people were talking about it. I'm in the same boat as Patrice, except I'm getting to uh, whip the women just around midnight. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in the same boat as you. I will not watch. I will not read the book if the movie comes out. But Fox if enough but people the book's keep been talking for, about it, but the, the book's, book's been, been out for how many years, years and you haven't read it yet? Yeah, I would get around to it. I'm reading other stuff. <laughs> I read that book easily two years ago, maybe the more. The Vinci Code is yeah, it good. It's really good. It's a page turner. I got. I read you. Animal House. <laughs> Before that came out. Oh, wow. <laughs> Let's say, like, I get the book that has the characters from the movie on the cover. Man, John Belushi, he'd be great as this character. Oh. Let's say hi to Lady Trucker. Lady Trucker. Hey, how you doing, Patrice? Hello, ma'am. 
I got a hook for you. Peanut butter on cracker. Oh. P for your brown sugar answer oh, song. Answer oh, the song. answer, yeah. I got to figure that out. I'm going to write it. Mm -hmm. All right. I'm definitely going to fucking write it. Yeah, Fuck that. That's one to write. <laughs> a follow up hit to It's Raining Stuff. It's Raining oh, Stuff. Here he is. <laughs> Good luck. Here he is. He's got his own uh, entrance music and everything. It's the Jurassic he's... Park music because of his short little arms. <laughs> he's got a little T-Rex oh, arm. Well, yeah, you wouldn't have been. He hides it with we really cruelly big cruelly pointed shirts. it out. He's like uh, the T-Rex. <laughs> Actually, they don't really look short today. No, it's the shirt. Because the shirt goes down pretty like. <laughs> Most people's arms, I think, dangle almost to their kneecap. Their middle finger almost hits their kneecap. He can scratch his titties without bending anything. <laughs> <laughs> Your mama. <laughs> what are you? Auditioning? Jesus, motherfucker. That is a bitch, Your dude. mama. All right, we get Does it. Does anyone Does notice? It, do you really need to show it out <laughs> about it? <laughs> I oh can't. My, I could. I watched I can't seven believe that seconds of that fucking show. Crap is on on MTV. Maybe eight seconds. Your of mama. Oh, with that <laughs> corny, evidently a sissy, mm. dude. Oh. Nick Cannon. Wait, no, not Nick Cannon. The fucking uh, the, the dude, dude from, from your mama. Um, the '70s show, right? Oh goodness. No. Goodness. Was it? The, I don't know. Yes, yeah, the, the Indian. Tom, country. how are you? Pretty good. How are you? See, <laughs> that's yeah. how, that's all he gives us. <laughs> Pretty good. Uh, people ever noticed about the arm thing or anything? Yes. They brought it. Your friends have always like kind of teased him about it. Yes. He's shaped Bastard. like five different people. Like <laughs> he's in shape, out of shape. He's got a big head, a little head. His, his head's big and little at the same time. <laughs> he was this close to being a dwarf. <laughs> Maybe he that was like it. at the last minute. At the last second, God said, "Ah, no, I'm just kidding." <laughs> <laughs> he really is built like a fetus, <laughs> like a oh, like. Look, like you can see his fingernails. He really is built like a the second trimester. <laughs> <laughs> your mama, your mama, your mama's so, your mama's arms are so short. <laughs> A whole fucking show about that. Uh, they've God, run out of ideas in Hollywood. It's official. <laughs> Your mom is so black when I look at her, I think I'm asleep. <laughs> <laughs> and that's the reaction half that's, the time. You're like, huh? Yeah, oh, well, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, I got that's, you. that's funny, yeah. Mm. Anyway, Tom. Well, Tom, uh, have you uh, gotten any energy? Since you've been uh, here this yeah, morning, a little bit, a little bit. I kind of hear it in your voice. He's a radio DJ too, Alan. Wants a to be Alan Lice, right? very famous writer in studio. It's nice to meet you. I'm uh, happy to be here. Happy to uh, What's your witness, favorite? witness what? a moment like this. What's your favorite band? Um, I'm more into hip hop, but that yeah. counts. Other than that, too short. <laughs> Motherfucker, too short. <laughs> Bismarcky and fucking too short. <laughs> too short. He looks like Bismarcky and too short put together. <laughs> Bottle of Clorox. Oh. I guess like, in terms of hip hop, probably D Block and uh, mm. for rock, probably Linkin Park. Nice. Mm. All right. Do you like? Sounds the, very enthusiastic. Do you about like it. the collaboration with Jay Z? What, happen, right. what happens when Jay Z says right. throw your hands in the air? <laughs> <laughs> he hits himself in the in his ears. <laughs> Fuck you, fucking up. asshole! <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we noticed that he sounds a lot like Stephen Wright All with right. his uh, monotone delivery. So, so we just wanted to hear a few of uh, the classic Stephen Wright jokes done. Yeah, we highlighted the better ones voice. for you there. Made it real easy for you, Tom. All right. Yesterday, I parked my car in a tollway zone. When I came back, the entire area was missing. Yeah, that's about it. Kind of sounds like Yeah, the guy. that's about how he does it. This is almost like your mama. <laughs> that's I what you pay stuff. $100 for. <laughs> <laughs> I had to stop driving my car for a while. The tires got dizzy. All right, a couple more. I recently moved into a new apartment, and there was this switch on the wall that didn't do anything. So anytime I had nothing to do, I just flicked the switch up and down, up and down, up and down. Then one day I got a letter from a woman in Germany. It just said, cut it out.
I put instant coffee in my microwave oven and almost went back in time. <laughs> These are hard. <laughs> How come when when Stephen Wright does it, people laugh? I think it's visual too. I get kind of yeah. Gotta be right, because when you just Probably. read them or hear them, because it sounds just like Steve. Sounds like him. I'm he's... like, oh no, is Stephen not funny? It can't be. <laughs> Maybe Stephen's not funny, but no, oh, he's funny. Let's turn him on and get a chuckle. Fuck me, yeah, of course he's funny, but what the fuck's going on here? All right, a few more there, Tom. It's a weird experiment here. I saw a man with a wooden leg and a real foot. Maybe he's not delivering it exactly. Like, read that one again. But well, Steve, would, nothing uh, can make that one funny, Patrice. No, you know. A man with a wooden leg and a, and a real foot. foot. Yeah. See, it's like he's not reading it with the timing of Steve. It's all right. the ingredients to a cake, but they're not mixed right. Beat, just like his body. <laughs> all right, it's all the parts look. you need, but they're just not put together right. This next one, read. You know what beat is? You know what they say when you get beat? Of course you do, right? Okay. So just do the do the I met thing with a beat and just wait a beat and then do the... The last thing, the punch. See, see if that's Stephen Wright. I met her at Macy's. She was shopping. I put slinkies on the escalator. I was uh, put. Oh, oh wow! Boy. Yeah, it gets even worse when you miss a word. Dennis Leary's not calling you anytime soon to read. No. Uh, um, Some people think George is weird because he has sideburns behind his ears. I think George is weird because he has false teeth with braces on them. George is a radio announcer, and when he walks under a bridge. You can hear him talk. You, you what? You can't hear him talk. You can't hear him talk. Yeah, see, because oh, you, you drive under a bridge. <laughs> and wow, you are leaving out the, the <laughs> most important word. In the past two, he's left out the most important word. But he's doing pretty good on them long ones, though, because I'm thinking, like, what yeah. the fuck? <clears throat> ah, some short ones. I bought some batteries, but they weren't included, so I had to buy them again. That's see, Stephen Wright. That's Stephen that's, Wright. That is him. It's funny when Stephen Wright says it. What? What? I don't get it. Maybe Stephen Wright is brilliant. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. <laughs> I bought some batteries, but they weren't included, so I had to buy them again. Damn. But That's if you do that hard. in quiet, in a room, in isolation, in a studio, so I, I mean. Can you can you get those across anyway? <clears throat> that's that's very fair too. The the it, it, the crowd means something too. I think if, yeah. if if like you said, if Galilee came in and just smashed a watermelon, no one would laugh. Like we would go, okay, this nigga just slapped, he smashed a watermelon with a hammer. I don't care if he's in front of the entire population <laughs> of this country. That shit ain't funny when he smashes that fucking watermelon. No. All right, Con Jesus. Continue, wow. Tom. If you can't hear me, it's because I'm in parentheses. Plus, maybe that's funny. We're reading along. We know the surprise. I mean, oh, we know okay. the thing that's coming. All, All right. right. I'm, I'm not reading. Right. Put your right. down. The... All right. Fair oh, enough. wow. Very good observation. That's why, right. I'm, the, that's that's why I'm the journalist here. I'm trying to, right. you know. Understand, right? It's like, wait You're a minute. You're waiting for it. Because I'm about to go to Steve Wright going, maybe this is funny. <laughs> and maybe this is, maybe this is killing to people listening at home. Uh, maybe right. this is working. I've been reading this. I'm just asking. I get it, Tom. I have a map of the United States. It's original size. It says one mile equals one mile. I didn't, I didn't read along with that one, <laughs> but I, I did read it earlier. There goes that theory. So, well, no, no, maybe turn the page. I re, re, re one that page. we didn't, uh, you didn't write. Turn you the page. Uh, there you go. You didn't highlight, right? Now just read one. I'm going to clear my mind. I'm going to shut my eyes and imagine Stephen Wright. Well, do the one after the, in front uh, of me. the original size map. Stephen writes in front. Mm -hmm. Today I met with a subliminal advertising executive for just a second. <laughs> That's a tough joke, though. Uh, it's almost funnier, though. If you picture <laughs> Stephen Wright. I was sitting there. I was in the crowd. I was at the stage. <laughs> I had the whole thing. I can't <laughs> and this is a, today is experiment day. Of it, is. it is. This is whole show is a big uh, beaker. Let a rip. I used to be a bartender at the Betty Ford Clinic. I keep waiting for the next line. I had a dream that all victims of the pill came back. Boy, were they mad. Today I dialed the wrong number. The other side said, hello. I said, hello. Could I speak to Joey? They said, uh, I don't think so. 
He's only two months old. I said, I'll wait. I have a friend named Dennis. Both his parents are midgets, but not Dennis. He's a midget dwarf. He's the guy who poses for trophies. Now, I saw his original eight hour special when he said that joke. Uh huh. And I laughed like a motherfucker. Right. <laughs> I laughed like a... I thought that was the funniest joke I ever heard. He poses for trophies. <laughs> it's hysterical. But why the fuck did that just make me want to hit this motherfucker with a branch? <laughs> well, don't get mad at him reading jokes he didn't no, write. No, but I'm saying... <laughs> he, but he's re he sounds just like Stephen Wright. Right. It's the same delivery. It's the... But even in fucking Reservoir Dogs, it's like... I think it has to be no one else can do it but him, maybe, because yeah. he goes, uh, you know, the radio guy, when he's like, yeah. K210. It's like, maybe he has a natural time. K-Billy's, yeah, it was K-Billy's, like, super hits yeah. of the 70s. Let's go to Mud Jacket. Mud Jacket. Hey, I just got a question for Tommy. Yeah. Hey, did you ever get a chance to do the wave last night, the baseball game? <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Or is that why you're so fucking tired this morning? Because you kept trying to jump up and just couldn't quite keep up with everybody. The way no. <laughs> he stopped all the waves. The people went, oh, no one else is doing it. Do we have uh, access to some of the Comedy Channel's uh, stuff on Dillette? Do we have any Stephen Wright? I would love, let's hear Stephen Wright. I want to hear Stephen Wright doing Stephen Wright and see what the difference is. we got to get to the bottom of this. Danny in Jersey. Danny. Hey, boys. Hey. Yeah. Holy shit. Now I know why Stephen Wright doesn't sell any albums. But he does. On the radio. But he does. He does all right for himself. We we don't understand why it's not working. Oh, uh, I think it's Stephen Wright's looks. That's what's funny. It could be his <sighs> appearance is, but no, because we, but we, I listen to the album. When yeah, you listen, out, you listen to the records. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Okay. He's funny. He's a funny dude. This man. is like graduate school comedy analysis. This yes. Is, this is like you, why yeah. isn't it working? Did you see um, Half Bank when he was on the guy on the couch? Yeah. He's fucking hilarious. Hysterical. All right. Hey, why isn't he funny? By the way, uh, the Twitchell video from yesterday of him slapping his face when we discovered that's his latest thing he yep. does is now up online for everyone to view. Very good. At opianthony.com. Is he still here, by the way? Yeah. Found some Iraq. What's up, Than? Okay. No, I was going to tell him which jokes that we have. Oh, we got the same joke. All right. So you can do them too. <clears throat> Today, well, who do Actually, Than, stay there. Have him read the joke, and then we'll get the Stephen Wright version after he reads it. Uh, uh, it's a whole bit, so it might not be the exact joke. It's oh, I see. Okay, okay. <laughs> well, just have him do whatever you want first, and then we'll have a reference point. It's the Winnie jokes. All right, here we go. My friend Winnie is a procrastinator. He didn't get his birthmark until he was eight years old. It'll be funny if Steve Wright calling and go, this nigga's chopping up my <laughs> shit. Tell this little old motherfucker, if he gonna read my shit, read it right. It's like this. Batteries. Batteries. <laughs> right. They weren't included. <laughs> You're like Steven wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Steven. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Winnie and I lived in a house that ran on static electricity. If you wanted to run the blender, you had to rub balloons on your head. Now, that was pretty I, spot on, Stephen Wright. I yeah, know. That was he's pretty fine. Fucking yeah, Stephen Wright. Pretty fine man. delivery. We're gonna have him on in the future as Stephen Wright and not tell anybody. And then they'll think it is funny. It sounds hell. just like <laughs> Stephen Wright. There's dude. a little piece of Stephen Wright that's missing. That sounds like somebody else. Kind of does something with his voice Damone uh, almost yeah not a Damone no it sounds like something else have Can't some pride place him. have some pride that uniform is part of the <laughs> might be him right alright are we going to listen to the real Stephen right now is that yeah let's listen to some real Stephen Wright honestly I ain't flying nowhere <laughs> He has, a, he has a different inflection, too, on some yeah, yeah. up and down. He's not straight it's monotone. It's not just monotone. I don't know if that helps, but wow. he, he does have a different different delivery. All right. Thanks, Tom. Holy oh, shit. Job well done. There you go. How did you get the headphones off? But that help. <laughs> he need help reaching the door now. He can, he's, too, he's too high and too low for the door. Where's his music? <laughs> yeah, where's his music? He doesn't leave, Derek? Uh, Oh, Derek. Yeah. I love that music. Yeah. Twitchels, come on in here. Steven, right? Yeah. Mm. 
That was interesting. Right. Here comes Learned Squid Learn some Shoals. things today. Yeah. Brown sugar. <laughs> yeah. right, John? Oh. I once knew a guy named Twitchells that put pubic hair in his face. You're yeah. all cleaned up now, man. <laughs> yeah, not too bad. <laughs> yeah? You got all the hair off you? Yeah. Where'd you get a new shirt? When I was wiping the water on my face to try to, like, uh, you know, waterfall it off, uh, pubic hair kind of went right in my mouth and got stuck in my tooth. <laughs> oh, whoa. <laughs> so the torture continues even in the bathroom. <laughs> That's the gift that keeps on giving. Yeah, right? <laughs> 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 Oh, God. Like, he's just he's like mm. <laughs> Did that sound like one of one of the Beastie Boys? <laughs> <laughs> it's, a it's a sabotage. <laughs> <laughs> Here's a little story. <laughs> <laughs> Those guys could definitely do something with that though, I'll tell you right now. It was fun. I had a good time. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you cleaned up, which is uh, good. Absolutely. <laughs> That's what I was going to say. All right. Well, what's Stephen Wright with Tourette's sound like? Uh, buh, buh, buh. T -t 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 Bring. <laughs> really? I was, I was pulled over for speed, and the officer said, don't you know? <laughs> I replied yes, but. <laughs> 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 yeah, I know. Yeah, we, <laughs> we know. We feel the same way. So <sighs> get the plug in for the comedy show there, Twitch. Well, it's going to be tomorrow night. It's the premiere of the short bus comedy tour. <laughs> At the Laugh Factory in Times Square, it's a uh, nine o'clock show. It's going to be really, it's going to be a really hot show. I'm really excited about it, and uh, it's our <laughs> first time doing the short bus tour in New York City tomorrow, nine o'clock at the Laugh Factory. And you got some coverage? <laughs> yeah, on Monday, as soon as I got back from the Tourette's conference, <laughs> uh, I did a show called Your Morning on CNA. They're an Emmy award-winning uh, morning show uh, that reaches from Maine to Virginia. <laughs> Emmy award-winning. <laughs> I say that because every show is from Maine, Maine award-winning. Exa exactly. Yeah. Exa and I was so nervous because that's all when won I just won. Well, that's just when I got back from the conference. From Maine to Virginia sounds impressive, but how wide is it? I, I, I it's like two feet <laughs> wide. That's not that impressive. Well, it was Monday, so it was, that was right after I got back from the conference. And I've been on the show a couple times before, and it never really had been that bad. Usually I was able to control it while doing the interview, because like a five-minute interview. And all the short bus guys were there, and it just went ballistic. I just couldn't help it. And uh, the girl who interviewed me, the, the reporter, name's Connie Cola, and she's actually she's been really good with it before, but I really think I made her feel uncomfortable this time. <laughs> All right, let's listen in. I met, when I first started doing comedy, I met Tim Grill. And as you can tell, Tourette, you have good days and bad days. Sure. And, you know, when I first met Tim and I started, I said, I said, what do you have? He said, I have Spina Bivida. And we were on the same show together. So I said, you know what? It would be a great idea to put a tour together, some type of show featuring all comedians with disabilities. Right. And I heard so much about Mike Cattell. He's been doing the scene in New York for so long. And I just, it's never been done before. And I fear this would be such a... <laughs> Good oh, idea. Wait, that's the Dunkin' Donuts coffee. Uh, <laughs> Just right kicking there. in now, right? Yeah, that's exactly. Yeah. That's the Dunkin' Donuts going to rest. Let me do it to rest. You're right there, buddy. <laughs> You're okay. You can be a little back with us. Wow. That poor lady. We got more. I always have people who say to me, they say, oh, you have Tourette's? Oh, yeah. I'm so sorry. Things like that. But you know what? The point is, we're doing this because we want to spread awareness and have a good time. You can never take yourself too seriously. And, you know, that's all, the whole point of this comedy tour. It's not, you know, making fun of the characters of any, you know, not making fun of the people who have disabilities because we are people yeah. with disabilities. We're saying be yourself and it's okay to be yourself. <laughs> He's really fun to take to church, isn't he? Uh, <laughs> he's the only guy who gets road rage. Oh, he's, he's the only guy who gets road rage on, on a train. <laughs> wow. Road rage. He's the only guy that gets road rage on a train. <laughs> <laughs> Right. Sayonara. <laughs> he's speaking Japanese, the motherfucker. Uh, Sean in Virginia. Sean. Hey, boys, I learned that uh, Twitchell's in the bathroom sounds like the three stooges fuck it. Uh, that's right. We did learn that uh, Learn that today, yes. Let's go to Bruce in Louisiana. Bruce? Yeah, today on the show I learned that rubbing the balls between the thighs equals wink-wink. 
Wink, wink. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. We did learn that. It's a given. Brian in Rhode Island. Brian. Hey, how you doing? I learned that a cock ring makes your dick all veiny and blue. Yeah, we learned a lot of weird stuff today. <laughs> Ben's raw ass. Hey, guys, today I think we all learned a little something about the brown sugar lyrics. Yes. The, I, I wonder how many people out there really knew that. that Honestly. A, I think that was a surprise to a lot of I people. think a lot of people like to come off like they're cool and they knew, but uh, they didn't. Yeah. yeah. Alan Light's uh, book, The Skills to Pay the Bills, The Story of the Beastie Boys, is now in paperback. In stores now. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> and that's the reaction we're looking for. You say you get no feedback on a book, you get that, you know you're doing something. He's got, he's got ringtones. He's got oh, ringtones. Oh, by the way. They're, they're, when do I get my ringtones? They're going to be available any day now. They're, they're already available overseas. Uh, you just Google it. And Over, the, I know. I don't even tell what, me. They, what are you, a phenomenon in, no, in no, Germany? Like all the hair bands? It's like it's David Hasselhoff of Tourette's. <laughs> Banned in China. Right. Yeah. We don't write the bring. He said it was in China. Don't do your bring or to <laughs> Sounds too much like some shit we say. Yeah. <laughs> they understand him. <laughs> C. Uh, you, uh, did I just say C? C. <laughs> uh, and you can check that out at Laughter by Lou. Mexican Talk part of China. China. <laughs> I don't know any Mexican two. town. Yeah. Mexican Chinese <laughs> bastard. Fucking stupid as <laughs> What do you do? See. Uh, <laughs> let's uh, let's say hi to John. Hey, John. Yeah, today I learned that dignity is a disease. <laughs> uh, yes, we did learn that. <laughs> sorry, right. sorry, I was a little distracted. Sorry about that. Mark, uh, no, dude, I just want that. Uh, Mark the trucker, what's up? Hawk. Guys, today I learned your intern's arms are so short he's got to sit down and jerk off. <laughs> His arms were short. He had to sit down and jerk. Right. Oh, there you right. go. Sean in Jersey. Sean, what did you learn on the opening after the show today? I learned that niggas wear Yankee hats because they match their socks. Word up. Word. Uh, Asshole. Yo, boy. What's going on? Hey. The ball brush is a massagist. Wink. There, yeah, we said that one already. Yeah. I blow. All right. Token, uh, token gay. Hey, I learned that Twitchell's plus Danny's pubic hair equals jerking off material for a week. Oh, Jesus. Howdy. That's, that, was genius. that was genius. That was actually genius. Hey, Trish, are we uh, promoting anything today? Nah. You're doing the show with us for the rest of the week, so. Yeah, you'll be in uh, tomorrow, tomorrow and Friday. Nice. 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 R yeah. Stare at me a little more, please. Final words. <laughs> Go to laughterbylou.com for the ringtones. And be, for the <laughs> I'd like to add. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. He does sound like a Hitler Stop speech. Stop slapping yourself. Right. 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 Right.